Greetings, bird. Um, I'm, 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 I'm unsure. Do I free bird or we run? Run. 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 We we absolutely fucking run. Oh my! It, 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 it's an owl. Run. Just go. Run. If we free bird, maybe it will save us run. or thank run. us later. Just- Let me know when we're good. Thank you, Jeff. I mean, we're, we've been rolling for about 30 seconds. Oh, six. Great. So that's just, <laughs> it's one of those. It's one of those. Oh. Hello, uh, and welcome to episode three of Who Lives Who Dice. Yep, good. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's a wrap. That's it. That's it. Great. We're done. Um, thanks so much for coming. Uh, it's great to have you here again. Uh, we're here for another episode of some shenanigans um, and everything else. And just head a welcome once again. I'm um, for Sasha Burgoyne. Guy Samuels, Rose Redon, Cheryl Berniston, and Mr. David Cox. Uh, yeah, how, how are you guys feeling about it? Professor David Cox. Professor David Cox. Professor yeah. David Professor Cox. Professor David Cox. So it's gone Cox. from Master David Cox to Professor. Honestly, it's, uh, the amount of time has passed in the last week is amazing. How did yeah. you, you get a PhD so quickly? I, I, I'm just a doer, Matthew. <laughs> <laughs> Not a thinker, which you'd think you need for a PhD. Yeah, just a doer. Do a doer. I <laughs> went and I stole one. You stole one. Yeah, you didn't get a Photoshop and like draw it. Exactly. Down, that, that would have been smart, but I'm not a thinker. How are you guys feeling about what's about to happen? I'm sure Excited. that nothing untoward will happen. We'll be fine. And before half an hour, we'll be sat singing campfire songs and just really bonding. Yeah. You, you brought the guitar, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You brought the guitar. Yeah. yeah. Good, 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 good. I assume Guy's got one, like, built in. I can, I can afford one. He's, he's, yeah. yeah. he's a walking mandolin. Hang on, let me just take my drums yeah. on. Yeah. <laughs> Multi-class is barred for level two. You mm. see, if Dirty Tear 22 was going to play anything, I thought it would have been a hurdy-gurdy. <laughs> I, I think it's like an accordion on one leg. Yeah. Well, That's why he does it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Cool. Anyway, thank you again so much for joining us. Um, everyone else who made this possible, please check them out. Links in the description. We have artists, musicians, thank you. Um, creators who've done more stuff with Battle Math. Thank you so much. Um, they're wonderful people. Um, but yeah, I think with that being said, let's jump straight into episode three of Who Lives Who Dice. <laughs> party found themselves arrested and imprisoned by the town guard of Erist. Mayway, thinking quickly, made a daring yet very narrow escape, hiding under the docks and returning to Addie the giant bartender to seek what little help she could find. While being confronted by the guards, she was saved by an intervening half-elf named Dexon, who charmed the would-be arresting party and hid Mayway, agreed, agreeing to help her break her friends out and return for a future favour. They developed a plan to sneak Mayway in, magically disguised as one of the lead proprietors of a known smuggling, smuggling ring. Meanwhile, the rest of the party was stripped of their few belongings and locked in different cells. Some fared better than others in the aging prison. While Saskia got a great workout in, the other party members escaped through strength, skill, or tricking the guard into handing over their own weapon. Milo was eventually surrounded by the guards, and in her attempts to dissuade them, proceeded to instead evaporate them with a well-placed Thunderwave spell, triggering the rest of the jail into, a pr- into chasing them down. At the thunderous explosion, Mayway entered and convinced the guard captain to allow them to leave with their items, only realising they had been tricked as they were exiting the prison. Dexon got the party out on an escape cart and through more magical t- trickery, boosted them past the guard, down the road away from the town. After a quick goodbye and reminding Mayway of the favour, he teleported away, leading her five heroes now escaping into the nearby forest, with a contingent of soldiers chasing after them. So, as you make your way escaping into the Westlight Woods, with a small army chasing after you, what would you like to do? Run? Keep yeah. running. Run? Yeah. Run. Run. Yeah. Yeah. Run. I've been doing a lot of that, so I've, you know, really... <laughs> 
I'm pumped up. I'm yeah, good to run for days, guys. Uh, so actually, if you look at Saskia, up. she's looking a little bit pale at the moment and a little bit sweaty. She's oh, seen yeah. better days. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now, I just need to know this. How? Uh, what, what is our running order of how we're, how we're going to the forest right now? Who's, who's taking the lead? Are you running side by side? I'll peg. Your pick? Straight in. <laughs> <laughs> Pegging it straight in. Great. All right, Sasuke is straight in. Uh, straight because in. someone with more than ten hit points should probably be there. I'm going to be like side by side. Okay. With Sasuke. Much no. healthier, Alexi is like, like taking a somewhat oh. weird caretaking to the roll. Takes after Sasuke. Deep, deep swishing in the wind. I'm, I'm here for you. <laughs> um, I, I, I'm yeah. gonna keep pace with Mala and follow behind. Cool. The two, and then yeah, I'm, I'll, I'll I'll bring up the rear. You're I think up, with, a, up with, up with, with a nice uh, robo- robotic robotic uh, plodding <laughs> <on> grace. <laughs> Wait Sorry. for me. <laughs> and it's just disappearing to the line, so it's quite a like it's all family, like a Still. hard line of wood. So it's, it's a very clean line. It's very thin at the start, and it thickens very quickly. You take a glance, you can see. Um, if anyone wants to make a perception check as the last one. Uh, since you're the last one, if you want to make a quick perception check, mm-hmm. please looking towards the town so yeah, if you like escape it. into the woods. That's right. Five. It's five. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you 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 don't you see you see some blurry shapes coming in. You hear a couple of shouts, but you don't see anything specific as you dip in. Cool. Now how this is going to work? Um, you're just going to roll a dice, and depending on how it goes, it's going to be you're gonna, either going to get away or you're going to get caught very quickly. So we're going to go around the room. We're going to start uh, with um, actually no, who's at the front? We're going to start with Saskia. Uh, roll a d10 for me, please. Oh, what does that one look like? That uh, one. This one. No, no, it's... No, I keep... That, that one. Oh, so close. No, it's so close. Oh. Completely incorrect. Nice. Yeah. A nine. A nine. Nine's good. So you, you run in and, like, there's a couple of small patches with the trees that haven't quite come in properly yet. And as you come, you see a herd of elk all, all sort of, like, stop and turn their head up and look at you all of a sudden. You're going to stand there and watch? You're going to keep running? Uh, I'm going to wink all at the elk. Running. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna keep going. Okay, which way? North, west, or east? I'm gonna go north. So north directly towards keep the going elk. Straight, yeah. Go straight. Okay, cool. As I, soon as you start cool. running towards, they see five adventurers with weapons and different armaments, and the elk uh, sort of like start for a second, and they all scatter. Mm-hmm. Um, two of them start running towards you. I need dex saves from everyone, please. Oh, for fucks! D twenty. Yes. Here we go. Oh. Ugh. Nope, that was copped. Cool. That was in the middle of the worst anyway. 21? 7. 7. So Alexi, with the side of you, isn't really paying attention, like, and you, you get buckled a little bit and step out and you get trampled. Uh, one point of bludgeoning damage. 7 as well. 7 as well. Same for you. You get knocked. Alexi bumps into you. You're knocked to the ground. One point of bludgeoning damage. 17. 17. Sorry. Oh. sorry. <laughs> yeah, cool. 17, you're completely fine. With a bit of grace, you actually get your hand up and you sort of flip over one of the elk. Tap its bum on the way as it goes and it like flies <laughs> off into the forest. 18. Not today, 18. Honey. Um, you, you try to match it, but instead of you sort of just hold your ground and you actually staunch out the elk, turn to the last minute, it's like, nah, it's not messing with you. 21. 21, you'll come by the time you get in there because you've been oh, looking at the forest like the elk already gone. Cool, easy there. Uh, cool, Alexi. <laughs> oh, right. Um, I... uh, you've gained, you've neither gained nor lost any ground in that round. So, okay, um, then with the elk, I'll just kind of quickly pull just turn to the forest. Well, I just grab a voucher up and then just keep fucking running. Cool. So yeah. Quick, straight ahead. Uh, yeah, roll, roll a d10 for me, please. Okay. Uh, and a direction as well from you, thank you. Uh, north three. North three. Uh, cool. You you come running in, and one of the streams on the aqueducts that feeds into the city comes about. I need all you make acrobatic checks to try and jump it, please. Okay. Uh, standard roll, uh, just a straight acrobatics check. You've had enough of a run up to get in. There's been nothing in your eyes. We can flag around so far. Hmm. Oof. It's a collective roll, so we'll see. You, you fail together, we succeed together. Oh, God. Ten? So Ten. Ten? Uh, Five. Twelve. Fourteen. <sighs> Alright, so what happens is Mayawe <laughs> takes the lead with these, yeah, like by one with that roll, and you just made it. Uh, <laughs> yes. So okay, Mayawe sprints good ahead and effortlessly jumps across, at the same time unhooks her chain and brings around a tree, and all three of you sort of all jump. You two just make you grab the chain to pull in. You fall in, you grab the chain at the last second, you actually get a little bit wet on your boots, pull yourself up, up and through, just sort of making it. Skills. Nice, still haven't gained any ground yet. Well uh, anyone wants to make a perception check? Sure. Cool. cool. I'm going to use a different dice because this one has been betraying me. <laughs> That's mm. better than what that one's been doing. Uh, 18? This way! Over the river! Over the river! Cool. Uh, next one, who's on the line? Uh, third one in, I believe, was you two running side by side. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, you made the jump, we'll get you to make a check, please. North, east, or west. All right. Um... We're gonna go east. We're gonna go east, cool. So that's heading away from the city further. Cool. Two. Two. Uh, so you come through, this, the forest is starting to thicken out just a little bit more, and as you come through, you suddenly find yourself caught in a very deep, sticky web um, all of a sudden, and you feel a slight creeping up your back. As you slow down for a second, um, one of you spots, guy, you spot a spider 
crawling up her back. Uh, if you just want to make a quick check to pull it off and throw it away before it bites her. Oh, pardon me. Oh, I need to roll again. Yeah, I didn't roll again. Let's cough, go again. Ten. Yeah, so instantly you see it, you, you grab it, just pull it and just throw it. It goes, <laughs> it goes away. <laughs> Cool, uh, Spiderweb did you slow you down, so still having, uh, you, you, you're falling behind, the shout's getting a little bit louder. Cop oh, rumble! Uh, east again. East again, cool. Yep. D10. Do, 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 do. Eight. Ooh. Eight. Uh, you, you, you have to clear around for a second, the ground even, evens up, like there's a few roots, you're dodging around, but the moment you feel like you're starting to get into a little bit of ground, the shout's getting a little bit quieter. Cool, D22. How are you faring in this thick forest with... I think pr- pr- pretty good. I got a bit of a rhythm, a rhythm going. Dum, 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 cool. dum, dum. Which way are you going? I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna follow you. Yeah, 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 yeah. East again. East, please. East, cool. Roll up. D ten. D ten. Oh dear. Is that a zero? Yes, yeah, zero is ten. Ten. <laughs> I thought it was zero, zero. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing like that? <laughs> no. So, as you're running, you come into a clearing. Um, you slow down for a second. Um, make a perception check for me, please. You guys will slow and you stop. The shouts have gotten a little bit quieter. Ooh. <gasps> Dirty 22. Dirty 22. Ah. You look ahead and you see what looks like a pile of leaves. Well, the leaves are heaving just a little bit. Do you want to get closer or do you want to run? Get closer. It could be you a pile closer. of gold. All right. Make a stealth check for me, please. <laughs> <laughs> I hope it's gold. Okay. <laughs> who's, who's, who's... Oh, 17. 17. All right. Just with the running order, I'm going to say you were, you were both sort of nearby. You hear chewing. 17. Cool. You get closer. Whatever this is hasn't seemed to have noticed you just yet. Um, but as you get, do you want to get closer still? You're about 10 Milo's, feet away at this Milo's point. going to be like... Yeah, I'm going to... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to listen to Milo and just stay. Exactly you're going to, you to stay away. All right, wait, stealth checks back off. <laughs> oh, 11. 11. Yeah. Just need to check what the passive is. <laughs> <laughs> You step back, a twig snaps, and the chewing stops. Oh. This big mound turns to face around. <laughs> and this giant, huge, hulking, first you think it's a bear, and it's got the face of an owl. Oh. Its face is covered in blood and turns to screech at you. And like this massive owl bear, about 10 feet tall, stands over you all of a sudden, and it lunges, and it stops. And you notice there's a big shackle around its ankle. You look just around the corner, you see a dead halfling just next to it. But the obvious, like, reach before it's grappling, it's going for you. It's like, it's just out of reach, but it's, it's angry. It's going for it. What do you want to do? Do you want to run or do you want to stay? Um, also, uh, shouts are getting louder. Um, greetings, bird. Um, I'm, 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 I'm unsure, do I free bird or we run? Run. Run? Run. We, we absolutely fucking run. I'm like, it, 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 it's an owl. Run. Just, just go. Run. If we free bird, maybe it will save us run. or thank run. us later. Just, just, and I grab him and I just kind of run around. <laughs> cool. Are you happy to go? Yep. All right, cool. Right, you pick him up, you run. Yeah. Good, cool. Uh, right, next on the list, back at the top. Uh, Sasuke, you run. It's thrashing, it's pushing by the chain. It's, it's a big hulking chain. Um, and it's just like making a lot of noise and roaring. And you hear, over here, over here, over here. As you disappear in the forest. Which way are you going? North. North, north again. Cool, roll a d10. Does anyone keep track of this? Because we're just going to like come back around. I've got, I've got. Oh no! Uh, we do, we're totally going to. You said seven. 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 Uh, yeah. Immediately, you're another clearing. Nice clear run through. All of a sudden, as you're running, uh, you hear this way, this way. Oh, oh fuck, fuck, fuck! And you hear, you hear, and you're ah! And you hear the sound of just slashing and screeching, and suddenly silence for a second. Just keep running. It did cool. help us. Next one. Uh, who was after? Yep, Lexi. <laughs> Four. Four. Uh, yep, you come through, the, the, the hill slips down a little bit, the roots come up, and you start just tripping through just, just a tiny, tiny amount. Um, Stumbles a little bit, you're a little bit slower, um, but if you want to make a, another perception check for me, please, both of you two. Yep. Nine. Yep, one. One? So okay, you don't, you don't hear anything. That's a seven uh, total. Cool. But... <laughs> Carrying on. Uh, who was next on the... Uh, no, wait. Oh, Jesus. Um, keep going strong. North, right? So it's north, still fine. Yep, fine. Yep. <laughs> yep, fine. I mean, I mean, Why? You know, do, do whatever you want, because it, it messes with you, and it's so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> D10, please. This one, this time. Oh, nine. Nine. Uh, nine. Yep, another clearing, straight through, nice and easy, not a problem. You guys are feeling good. I'm um, just getting away. Uh, make a perception check for me, please. Oh dear. 
uh, and Milo on deck. Yep. Yep. Ha, 21. 21. Ooh. Cool. So for a second you guys to think you're in the clear, the, the Albert or whatever it was, was was feasting, you can still hear some, they got Bill, they got Bill! You can still hear some footsteps, you're still being chased down at the moment. Cool. Milo. Alas, poor Bill. Um, West. West. Okay, West. Great. D10. Eight again. Nice. Eight again. Cool. Another clearing. God, can you, just, can you guys roll lower, please? Uh, yeah, running, <laughs> running through. You, you're zigzagging a little bit. You feel like getting away. You're getting some ground. You're getting some good momentum going. It's feeling all right. Cool. Yeah, I'm quite for following you. Just you. Let's, uh, let's crack on. Another D10. Another D10. Two. 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 You come through. You come to a. You come into a clearing. You guys run through, and you think it's another. It's another one's looking all right. Suddenly. Tripwire comes up, tangles you around the leg, and you find yourself dangled up above. The rest of you just sticking in nearby. Uh, is there a ah. tree nearby? Yep, there's a tree nearby. Okay, there's right. Can I sort of like jump onto the tree and try and like throw my dagger at the. I'm uh, making an attack roll. Okay. Uh, 17. 17. Oh. 17 hits. It's, it's, it's a rope that's designed for a small game. Yep. Straight through, catches, tumble to the ground, you take. Uh, one point of bludgeoning damage as you land hard on your shoulder. Um, as as that happens, you you hear, oh, what the fuck was that for? And then like three humans in like rugged sort of like brown cloaks sort of stand up from behind the tree where they were hiding behind. And like clearly hunters with like axes and stuff sort of in between. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Messages keep coming through. Uh, I will, ignoring them completely, I'm just gonna help Day 22 up to his feet and <laughs> Just you open a new road! I'll flick a fucking silver over my shoulder and run. <laughs> nice rope! <laughs> oh, Alexa, come on! <laughs> I'm running with this guy. Who's running with me? Yeah. <laughs> and while we run away from still. the uh, hunter's ass, I'm sorry! Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, maybe cool. we should go back and keep Back to the top? Yeah, yeah. keep That's going north. Keep going. North, north, north. North, north, north. Seven? Seven. Uh, right, as you guys sort of come sprinting through, the woods are getting a lot thicker and a lot thicker, and you're actually starting to push through, and it's feeling like you're not gaining as much ground. The shouts are getting louder behind you, you're not really sure what's happening. Suddenly, you feel like you're almost coming up against a wall of trees. Um, you can keep going ahead, or you can go left or right. You, you push, you feel like you can push through if you want to. You can push through, or you can take a different direction. I'm gonna push through. Point. You're gonna push through, yeah. make a strength check, please. Yeah. Um, I need a combined strength check from all five of you, thank you. There's a collective DC here. 17. Great. Natural 20. Ooh. Cool. 10. 14. 12. 12. Quite easily, you guys will sort of run up, and you don't, like, you've been pushing through this tree so much, you've been building up that, 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 that momentum again. As you come through, you come against the wall, and you sort of, like, you're all sort of pressing, and Alexia's like, fuck, fuck, fuck! <laughs> Straight through, and then all at one, you guys sort of, like, burst through onto the floor, and this massive clearing all of a sudden. And then the silence. Go team. Just a moment, you guys hear absolutely nothing. Should we no sound, no animals, no wind, no guards, just... What would you like to do? I will immediately draw my rapier. Um, I'm going to take a quick look around. Is it, are we still very much like in the thick of a forest? Is the sky the same? Make a perception check. Okay. Natural 20 again. Oh my oh. god. You are. Someone take this dice away. <laughs> yes. well done. Is that well the new one? Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, looking around, you, you, you coming through, with your previous natural 20, you stand up while the others are still like dusting this up on the ground. You look around. Um, you appear to be standing in like quite a, quite a large area. Um, the sky's clear, but the entire, there's a bit of a haze. Like the entire forest feels like sunrise or sunset. It's like a glow sort of coming through. Um, and looking around, it doesn't feel like a forest. Instead, it feels like you're suddenly on this weird sort of farmland. You're actually standing on crops. And as you look through, you can see a tiny little, um, like a worn down caravan made of wood, like a red, sort of like uh, red uh, with moss covered on, on the front. Just in front, you see a figure slowly approaching you, hobbling along in your direction. Okay, um, Alexi will sort of stand, still got the rapier drawn but not pointed and uh, to which he's just kind of uh, we, we we appear to have a, a degree of company i suggest you all get up rather quickly yeah 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 sure sorry uh, 
and I mean, does does someone who is actually good with people wish to address the? <laughs> yeah, Mayway, you do the uh, talking for the two uh, of us. All right, I'm sure I'll be fine. She's still a good hundred feet away. That's quite a big area. I'm gonna start like trying to help. D twenty two the shoulder. I'm gonna Alexi pop the raper away. This he's cool, and I'm gonna walk over towards this figure. Sure. All right, as um, we're going. I, like I, fo- I follow. Greet the figure and. Hey, how you doing? Well, hello. Um, would you mind not standing on the crops, please? So sorry, guys. Off the crops. And you notice you're all like crushing what looks to be, you know, quite a decent bit of work between you're not you're not small people. So. Uh, I'm so sorry. Um, where are we? Well, before you, uh, you said, well, you're um, you're in you're in my glade. Uh, I don't know how you got in. That's quite a quite an impressive feat. There's you look behind. There's five sort of silhouettes in the wall behind you. Where you push in a very clean one from Alexi. Looney Tunes um, style. Even even got like the deep V minute to like make. It <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if we don't mention at least once an episode, then what's the point? Uh, but before before what stands you um, is uh, quite a, a wizened looking wood elf. Um, some of the you've seen a lot of the younger ones. She looks very old. She's got quite dark golden hair, but there's grey streaks right throughout. Um, her one slender features are still quite sharp. There's, there's crease and wrinkles sort of in her very angular sort of face. She's hunched a little bit, um, sort of covered by like a large rag. Um, with her, it's quite a tall staff, about seven feet tall, with vines and different plants rolling in the front, and a large yellow diamond sits at the top, swirling in a little bit. She's leaning on it quite a bit, and as you look, you notice her arm is bandaged up and quite, quite bloody. And out of the sleeve, instead of a hand, is another. Um, plant wrapping around the staff and this seems to be connected to her. To her oh, hello, I'm, 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 I'm Nata. You didn't really answer. What, what, this is my glade, but what, what are you doing here? This isn't a, this isn't a place for, um, for, for people. I'm so sorry, we're, we're on the run. Uh, didn't mean to disturb you. Can, can we help you fix your... Are they? Oh, yeah, they're nightmare, right? Uh, yeah. Utterly um, relentless, honestly. It's been, sense. it has been a debacle. It's rude, it's so rude. Yeah. Yes. Well, well, why? Why are they chasing you? Have you? Did you? Did oh. you stick it to the man? <laughs> we certainly tried. Okay. Well, not, not very well. It seems. No matter. If you could step off, I'll. Oh, of course. I'll sort this out. We just want to head north, actually. Um, where's the best way to to go? Can we? Well, it's kind of difficult to say. This is enclosed. I can let you throw sure. me away, but there's. Yeah. Just please, please step off. Please step off. And she actually like starts to sort of knock you guys off and steps forward. And, we are mover. Um, yeah. She she puts her staff forward and. From, from the staff out, vines sort of grow up and fix the crops so you guys trampled and then it proceeds further to the wall and all those gaps sort of fill in with sort of like fresh plants and, and everything else and then she like pulls the staff up and back, right, no, no matter, um, you don't look very well. And just looking across all of you, I mean, you're all a bit battered, you've got a big gap where the dagger was, you are still looking very pale and not, and not great. Do you need to carry on, or can I can I help in any in any sort of way? I mean, we could probably do some rest and some food if, if you have anything for us. You, please. You, did you you know where you are, right? This is not a. Did you not have food? We have some, but um, if you have anything that could really help us quickly, I'd really appreciate I, I it. I have. Oh, I do. I did. I, I have. I have some stuff. Uh, please come, come, come Thank sit, you. come sit. And she she walk, starts walking towards the caravan. Beckons you guys to follow. Mm. You can follow if you want. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. I follow, and looking at Saskia, I notice that she doesn't look that great, quite pale, and do I have any idea what's wrong? Make a medicine check. Oh yeah, I'm good at medicine. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> no. What, what would you roll? I rolled a three. You thought you were good at medicine. She's, she's, she's very sweaty. Uh, yeah. Well, well we have been running. Yeah. We have been yeah. running. So Nata sort of hobbles along and just sort of like beckons for you guys a little bit. And you look around, like the sky is clear. It looks like a perpetual sunset um, over top of you. But there's crops here, like you've got rows of corn, potato plants. It's a garden she's tending to quite a lot. And there's bits and pieces and tools. You're really like old hoes and a couple of wheelbarrows and that sort of stuff. She's sort of like, come on. Just walking along the caravan, not looking back, just, just waving you through. Cool, what would you like to do? Uh, Alexi will sort of begin to walk, but kind of quietly to everyone. Just say, uh, I, I can't help but notice that she is referring to this place with a degree of uh, separation. Perhaps it would be wise to remain cautious. And respectful. Elves tend to be very territorial and protective of the things that they guard. I'm well, less of a guard and I'm more of a caretaker, but I'm, I'm glad I'm glad you've, you've got... She's got a brain on her this one. Come on. Everything's be fine, sister. I say that in elvish. 
doesn't respond. Could you define what you mean by stick it to the man? <laughs> <laughs> so she, she leads you in and she sort of says a few like matrix chairs and stuff around the caravan. And she's sitting down as you, as you ask this question. She sort of like takes, takes a while. She's very old and like, and you sort of like plops down. Well, those, um, those errors types, I've, I've seen the guards and they, they shake, they shake them down on the roads. And I just, I don't have much time for that sort of thing myself. This is my place, my domain. Um, but like I said to your friends, not, not much of a guardian, more of a caretaker. I, I live my life and try and keep things in check and balance as much as I can. But if they're chasing you through, I mean, there must be a reason. They genuinely don't care about things outside of the city. But sticking to the man means take something from the big guy, the top dog, the, the one in power. So if you're stealing gold or items, I don't have much time for thieves, I'll have you know. So don't, mm. don't go touching anything you shouldn't know. Ha 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 ha. You should not worry with me. <laughs> yeah, she, she 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 maintains pretty pretty composure with that. Just just without saying anything, turns turns towards you. And what about um, your little friend there, looking at Cyril sitting on your shoulder? Uh, yeah. Uh, this is this is Cyril. Um, she yeah. Holds her holds yeah. her arm out. Go. Comes up, so like nuzzles a little bit. Just, what what's a couple of uh, Filverell doing all the way down? Well, like, gives him some seed and like sets him off in the corner and just lets him rest and like takes up his hand cups that he's been wearing this whole time as well. Accessories, <laughs> <laughs> you did, yeah. You know, uh, the duties of the Val as we as we go, our people tend to go far and wide. You're Val, are you? I'm of the Val. Cool. She turns away from you. I'm just yeah. traveling. For a while, not many people leave from where, where you're about. Uh, yeah. Um, I found that my sort of magic didn't, you know, it wasn't, wasn't what they were um, looking for or they didn't have much teaching about it. So I, I, I thought, you know, I'll go out into the world. I told them I was going on a research mission uh, and yeah, just been... Traveling about. So you, you, you since then. You're, you're telling me you stuck it to the Val man, basically. You just. <laughs> yeah. I, I can I can appreciate it. That's, that's good. Haha. Uh-huh. She stuck it to the man. Mm-hmm. Very good. And what about you? Alexi puts away his notebook in this um, self inking quill. She goes. He oh. is the man. <laughs> Oh, oh I, uh, sorry. I, I normally people just talk to them, and I can sit in silence. What? Sorry. What's? I mean, you don't, you don't really fit in, dear. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Well, well. Um, are, are, are you are you here against your will? <laughs> well, technically yes, but also no. Alexi. What? Well, yes. She. No. What? Oh no. <laughs> Link, link, link twice if you're in danger. Uh, now I feel like I can't blink. <laughs> I'm not here. They, they are not my captors. We're his protection slash. Alexi's eyes are now rapidly <laughs> drying out. <laughs> I cheat, she believes that. Well, okay. Well, I, I, you seem, you seem like mostly seem like fine folk, and that's that's okay. Um, you said you need to head north. Yes, if that's okay. Well, of course. Well, what, what is north there? We yeah. just need to get as, as far away from these guards as, as possible. Oh, don't, don't you worry. The guards can't... That's why I'm so... You can't find this place. I, I don't know how you managed to... Right, you, you, keep, you keep saying that, and um, I'm, I'm a little uh, curious. What, why? Well, because I'm here. Yes, but, but why can't do you, one find it? You run through a forest and you know nothing about it. Do you not know of the Westlight Woods? No, I'm rather far from home. Uh, I can tell. Sorry, it's sorry. okay, Alexi. These yeah. these woods are they're special woods. Uh, it's okay. Okay, special in what sense? I I, if, I feel I need some specificity What's... from anyone. Well, it feels like your friend knows what. what we're she's we're in the about. West Light Woods. It's it's a place where it feels like it's always sunset. You always have that sunset coming through. It's very peaceful. Can you not feel that you're at peace here? I feel like I'm at peace. I'm just going to... Actually, dear, if I could interrupt you, you don't look very well. No, she, I'm just... She, <laughs> so she stops her saying she plants her staff and this large, like a white plum tomato grows out of it into Ooh. a good hand. Ooh. If you wouldn't mind just stepping towards me for yep. a moment, I promise. And she takes it, she crushes it in her hand. 
She takes it and she wipes it across your face. And then you guys sort of watch as like the glow sort of like intensifies and a small wind sort of picks up and lifts you off the ground for a second. And then out from her chest, this little like green mist sort of like seeps out of her skin, comes into the hand of Nata, and she into the gym. Uh, and she casts less, less restoration and you are no longer poisoned. <sighs> Thank you so much. That felt banging. <laughs> <laughs> ah, right. That's yeah. the colour you're meant to yeah. be. Hello. Dear, what is this banging? Oh, I was feeling great. Okay. Feeling great, Nata. Okay. Feeling okay. great. Okay. Do you mind if we rest here just for, no, just no, for no, a not, not short, short while? A short, short while. It's fine. Long while if you need as well. It's, it's getting on a little bit in the day. Um, I must ask, I'll, I'll leave you, your business is your own, but what, what is north, if I might ask? I can potentially help. There are, there are rumours. There are rumours that I'm, that I'm chasing. Um, there's, a, there's an old ruin, perhaps, up there. And yeah. I've, I've been through these woods numerous times. I know them quite well, but I've never found are you, these. Are you looking for old pine stuff? Sure, if that's, I'm, I'm unsure of its name. Well, you actually. don't seem to know what you're searching for. He's yes, on, it's, it's an ancient ruin. He's, he's one of the guardians of said ruins. He, right. he would be, he'd be probably more, more west, northwest sort of direction. I can, I can send you in the right way if you would like. Um, but, but why? Many seek, and there's not much reason to... He's, it's he's something that I've, I've heard from in my childhood, and I feel like it's something I'm seeking. And if I'm here, might as well give it a go. Right, right. And why were you running from the guards specifically? If trouble is coming... I need to know. They... St- Someone stole some things from... The Val. The Val. Uh, us. I guess yes. us. Um, and we went to go and get it back, and they tried to kill us, so we killed them, oh. and then guards came in and took us captive, and then we were captive, and then um, we got out. And that's the whole story? No. <laughs> she gets really close. She like stands up like a storm and like hobbles towards you and gets right up in your face. And I don't like liars. I didn't lie. And I don't like people who don't tell me the whole truth. And between you and me, I'm not super trusting of, of your kind. So if you don't mind telling me really what's going on, and she turns and looks at all of you, I'll be more willing to help you. Maybe even point you in the actual right direction. Guardian's not too friendly neither, but maybe you could help me out and we could work out a little bit of trust here. That's some stuff I need too. But it's not for now. How about you're welcome to stay here for tonight? I'm going to go tend to my crops, have a look at the damage caused. I heard old old Grouchy having a bit of a snack earlier. I need to check on my elbow, so that's okay. Oh, um, he was eating a halfling. Oh, no. And I think someone called Bill. I, I don't know a bill, but it sounds like he a had it. He, he uh, did. Uh, your your <laughs> owlbear has most certainly had a run-in with guards. He's going to get fat, I swear. All right. And she turns, and I'll leave you. I'll be back in a couple of hours. Please make yourself comfortable. Don't steal anything. Thank you, Kyle. You're welcome to stay as long as you need. Uh, Cheers, mate. B- before you uh, go, just yes. one very quick question. Uh, are we still... Is, is this a demiplane, or are we...? No, 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 there's no demiplane. It's just a bit of elven magic and some time trickery. It's uh, an old, an old elven trick that we, most of us used to have. Right. Uh, don't see many um, elven trickery back home, so I, you can understand why I was a little... Um, sure, sure. You, it's, is, he, it's... is he just a big nerd? Yeah. He, yeah, okay. Good. Yes. Uh, he's don't not don't think about it too hard. It's way beyond your comprehension, I promise. I and with really... that, she turns... And she's... She walks... And so she hobbles. Like, she's, she's old. <laughs> she's using the staff a lot. Like... The wound on her arm is very fresh. As she approaches the wall, it just sort of splits open from where you came, closes it behind her, and you're alone. It's roughly mid to late afternoon, but this is the first proper moment you guys have had to yourself since, well, in a while, since well before the arrest. The floor is yours. I immediately look at Marla. What is her problem with a Philvarel? Oh, well, I mean. What do we do? I mean, we're not the best. What? Like, you know, we're a bit isolated and yeah, but we don't narrow-minded. We don't turn anyone away from where from our home. We just protect it. Narrow-minded? How are we narrow-minded? Um. Well, if you have to ask how you're narrow-minded, then maybe that's not. <laughs> Lexi, you're going to talk to me about being narrow-minded. I'm, I'm, I argue that arguably my mind is quite broad in the sense of education. 
Yeah, yeah. in yeah. one sense, yeah. honey. Also, great to see y'all again. Uh, I'm gonna have a nap. Uh, yeah. Probably a good chat. Um, yeah, sorry, that was a bit of an untoward exit, but I couldn't think of anything else. Well, I could, but I thought it would be um, maybe conducive if we could go in back there to try and sneak y'all out. I'm, I'm sorry I couldn't get you out, Saskia. Yes, yeah, right, mate. I've really got a nap. I've worked out a lot today and I'm not going to eat some protein. If anyone can find me some protein, that'd be great. Just going to, like, hide Cyril. <laughs> Do you Cyril, think Cyril, like, just immediately, like, just behind your leg. Just... <laughs> Do you think they have any gold here? I strongly advise that we uh, don't to try to rob from the quite obviously powerful uh, magic user um, who is currently has us in the centre of her domain. Yeah, I, I'd agree with that. The... I'd also agree. For once. Okay, friends. Uh, uh, Martin, is everyone all right? Oh, um, uh, I mean, I think I've cut myself somewhere. I'll, I'll maybe have a bruise or two forming, but I'll, I'll be, I'll be quite fine. Uh, Milo, you, did you? It sounds as if you ran away, or rather, have lied to your. Um, I didn't run. I um. I. You know, it wasn't for me, and I thought that I could maybe... I maybe pretended I would be of more use to them outside than within the community, and have told them that I'll come back with lots of really good research about places. Mostly it's notes about beer. All right, we can be a little stuffy, I suppose, but... You know, we got good intentions and good hearts, which is not the most relaxed of people sometimes. Have you ever seen any others with a squirrel? I mean, no, I suppose not. I've seen the circus plenty of times. We, we don't harm animals. We're not active hunters. Yeah. We only like to grow things and heal things. We just have, you know, upper class views sometimes. Comes with living for hundreds of years. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, um, hmm. yeah. Did something happen? I'm getting a vibe. There's a bit of trauma going on. Do we want to talk about this or? I'm just surprised at this. Yeah, I feel like we had different experiences yeah. here. So How different, I suppose. Myla, darling, do you want to get, get it all out now? It, it's, it's just that if you're, if you're the kind of person who chats to animals, and um, likes trees and likes being outside, there's a place for you in society. If you're the kind of person who casts a load of spells and does amazing things and loads of magic, there's a place for you in society. There's not really one if you do both. But surely this makes you awesome. No, it kind of makes me a bit weird. <sighs> I think you just not met the right people. Maybe. But I'm great now. You know, I've been yeah. outside and met loads of cool people. And, um, yeah, you know, seen loads of good trees. And um, I've taken some quite good notes. And, yeah, it's, um, it's much nicer now. It's better. And one day I'll go back and I'll have loads of good research for them. There's never any obligation to commit your life to them. You can just do it if you choose. We've never stopped anyone from traveling. Yeah. Um, I, was, I wasn't really stopped. Um, encouraged, actually, maybe. To travel? Mm, to find a different purpose, hmm. I guess. Did they chuck you out? They chucked you out, didn't they? I don't know. About uh, this. Perhaps we should uh, uh, approach Chucked's such around. a. Yes, well, maybe we should approach that particular subject with a degree of sensitivity. I mean, it is clearly a source of some uh, emotional. Sars. D22 we don't chuck wants to persist. Out. His, his arm comes back in here and he re reaches inside and grabs an a oil stained, relatively dirty bit of cloth. Thanks. 
Would you like a, Would you like an actual clean handkerchief? Oh, why are you giving me bits of cloth? I don't know. I assumed it was some sort of social cue, and honestly, I tend to just follow what people do. They seem to know what they're doing. I don't think he does, though. It's in, in case you feel sad. Oh, okay. I, okay. Um, I'm not, like... It's just dif- it's just difficult and it's awkward because you clearly love love it and I I just yeah. I never wanted to do anything and no one ever told me I had to do anything you know I spent most of my life pretty relaxed and then I chose a path and no one ever really told me to do anything it was more um, they told me not to do things hmm. uh. I've not experience this at all. It's, um, yeah, it, you know, it just, just nature stuff, animal stuff doesn't seem to go, it's not what they're looking for. The, the book, there's no books about it. No one knows what they're doing. And, um, animals, I suppose not that much. We're plenty fine with them, but nature, mm. the whole point of the Rylithium is to heal the ground. Yeah. Yeah. To heal the land. Yeah. But, you know how there's all the, like, the people who are really magic, like, the, the, you know, like how I throw ice around. And there's loads of those. And that's great. Um, and then there's the people who tend to the land and there's the, the people who protect it and, and guard us. And um, I always kind of wanted to be one of them, but I can throw ice around. And no one ever quite knew what to, what to do with that, so they... Whichever place I was in, they told me to not do the other stuff. Hmm. That sounds like if I ever go back, something that we should work out. Oh, I don't want to be a bother. Um, <sighs> Come on now, there's a place for everyone where we live. Wait, it's your home, you're born there, so there's a place for you there. I... And if there isn't, then we'll make My My place at the moment is... Um... To be free. Yeah. Free yeah. as you like, honey. Yeah. No pressure. I'd like to know why Nada doesn't seem to like us much, though. We don't war on people. We don't steal. No, but like I said... A bit stuck up, maybe? I, 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 I get it. I suppose I that it's not an uncommon trait in the older elves, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. We just gotta try and show everyone that we're capable of change. Mm-hmm. So, hmm. are we agreed that as soon as possible we find gold and move on? Well, I, as, as much as I would prefer a more uh, broader view and uh, uh, ambition, yes, I think not being there, wherever the city is, is probably in our best interests. I agree. Hey. Hey. If we find the Rylithium and we bring it back, Mm-hmm. Get a huge reward. Interesting. Long-term gold for not short-term gold. But lots of gold, long-term. These terms seem agreeable to me. You're the strangest warforged I've ever come across. Processing. Thank you. You're welcome. Guys, I have an out-of-game question. Did Shoot. we have a place that we were going? Because my I notes from the last just game thinking that. I just are one quarter say. of a page long. We were running. We were yeah, running. we were, but running. I feel like we had the next town over that we were going to, and I... There was a next town over? Was there was a next there? town over? I don't know. There I... might not have been. I'm asking. Yeah, I'm, I'm totally you're shaking your head. Okay, okay. No, I feel like I we, take yeah. good notes. So... I take good So notes. there's settlements and there's trade points in between. You cool. can find, like, if you wanted to find a tent or something. But the nearest town, so you've got the capital of Eridan, which mm-hmm. would be, if you were to walk that, you'd be looking at the better part of, like, a week and a half to do that. Um, if you were to head really far east, you're going to like Dwarven land, you've got hilltop, um, upper top sort of ways as well. And then you get to, then you're heading towards, like, Dwarven area where you've got... Upper any, top? Upper top, yeah. Oh. Uh, it's like, like Gnome, but it's, it's kind of deserted now. It's some disaster ages ago. Um, but as you keep sort of heading east, you'll get to, like, Dwarven lands. Um, mm-hmm. That sort of way, and you're speaking to like this, this got Stoneheart. Um, but right now, like the forest you're in is, is, is quite large, and there's lots of bits and pieces. But you didn't really have a plan where to go next. There was also you were talking about Sile, 
um, which is where Connie kind of yeah. is meant to be, and that's more south doing? southwest um, ways. But all right, yeah, just checking. I yeah. felt like we had like we were like let's run to this t- place. Mm. I was just running. Excellent. I didn't know yeah, cool. Run away from guards. Just I checking. was just like gonna write stuff down. Yeah. And you guys want to check your bags because you didn't really do that properly. We I think now would probably I'll be check the, my bag. the wine's for gone, right? Inventory. The wine should absolutely the be gone. The wine's gone. All of your gold is gone. All of it. All of, it. All of All your of gold is gone. Not mine. Jesus. No. I didn't get uh, Not yours because you, you didn't lose your stuff. But everyone else has lost their gold. Yeah. Um, so I threw a silver back there that I didn't have. Yes. So you I did think about that and then, yeah. yeah. Like, Fool them. What do you think he swore at you? <laughs> I just thought he was an ass. <laughs> no, he just rolled a net one on his. So is that lost us all our. Like. Because when you say gold, any any money you're carrying, any coin is gone. Does that mean all of yours is gone? Oh, well? any any coin, any coin. Yeah, literally. Like when you check. How many it, times did he tell you to take so it all out? I took my gold, but not my silver and my copper. <laughs> when you were locked up, <laughs> they, took they, they took everything. Yeah. Anything. Okay. Anything. Okay. So you've still got like any of your important bits. You've still got. Yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Items, but like anything Where quick, they can make a quick turnaround on. Money. So you still got your potions. That's fine. Any anything else core to your character, like item bits, they're still there. But yeah, all your money gone. Okay. Yeah. Is the rhyolithium there? Uh, I I check. Check. Yeah, I checked yeah, the bag before there are I left. crystals in her bag, yes. Okay. So we have all ten crystals. Oh, uh, also no. Uh, no. Or... I was carrying four, we and they six. would have been taken. They've gone. No, so no six. Six. May were six crystals, there was four crystals. Do you sorry, I still have the four? Crystals? You, you've yeah. got four in your About that big, I think. Oh, That's so they would not have taken those. Rose checks, there's still four crystals in the bag. Okay, fantastic. Before I came to save you all. I made sure the crystals. Were I got them all drunk on the wine. They probably didn't notice the shiny <laughs> things. Um, but the other thing, you also have very long supplies. Mm-hmm. All your food, all your bits, they've also taken out as well. So you, you guys are currently, you are, you're in the woods without much in the way of supplies. Because mm-hmm. um, you ran out without stocking up. It's okay, so we can hunt. Yeah. Yes, um, I was actually thinking of suggesting... Uh, I've got ten days of rations, um, but that won't last as long. Perhaps it would not be advisable... Oh, no, you're fine, sorry. Yeah. 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 Form uh, parties of foraging and hunting. First of all, we need to get out of here. I'm open to try with anything. You're not into hunting? Oh. Foraging. I can show you good stuff to eat. You can be on the foraging team, hun. As, as you guys are talking, you hear Nata walks in with this big, very tame-looking owlbear walking behind with a bit of a limp where, where the chain used to be. And well, dears, if you're talking about hunting, I can recommend a couple of spots. I'm more of a vegetarian myself. Yes, where's good for vegetables? Well, here, yeah, she gestures around. There's like great yeah. everything. Yes, you're more than welcome to stay. I'll put a, I've got a bit of a stew in the back, and I hope you like potato and celery and uh, courgettes. Not really my thing, but that's 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 fine. Um, but if you do want to hunt, I there's something out ways. And if you're really good hunters, there's a bit of a beastie. I, I need some help with you. Don't mind. She spanks Grouch's arm as he walks up, and he sort of like grumbles a little bit and goes and curls up and starts sleeping in the corner. Um, still blood all over his beak. You see, like a tiny little bit of cape caught at the side, with like the same colours as the guard's armour. Like he's he's had enough dinner, don't you? <laughs> um, I, I realise I may have been a bit curt earlier. And I, I, I'm sorry. I do not trust people from the Val for valid reason. Um, however, I there is a bit of a beastie that's moved in near here, um, and I couldn't help but over here. I do hair everything, so good job not stealing. I'm very proud of you. Um, Oops. About about a two hour walk from here, there's a beastie that's taken up hold in one of the um one of the towers. Uh, now I don't like killing it, but I can avoid it. But it's been driven down from the north, and I think it's taken up a roost there. And really need someone to push it out. I'd rather it didn't have to die, but you can go and see at least why it's staying and what's causing it, and maybe drive it off somehow, or at least try to come to an agreement. I could potentially help with your supply problem and point you in the right direction towards your ruins, or well, maybe something else that's been happening in the forest as well, but I don't want to say too much yet. What but, kind of beastie? Uh, it's, um, it's like, it's sort of like a lion and a bird. Okay, team huddle, team huddle. <laughs> um, a lion slash bird, what do you think, guys? Are we in on this? I feel that perhaps it would be advisable to um, acquire a lot more information. Sure. <laughs> Anyone else? I'm happy to help, but I feel if we don't want to kill it, then Matt is going to be instrumental in working with her animals. So with the net 20, sure. you suddenly realise she's in there with you. <laughs> as I was saying, it's, just, it's called a griffin. Um, like, it's not, I tried, but as you can see, it didn't go well. I used to, I had a hand a couple of days ago. Um, oh, honey. Yeah, it's, it, it's, it's, it's growing back. It's fine. I'm not, I'm not too worried. Um, and you look like the bark growing out is like coming. She pulls the, the sleeve back and the oh. actual tree 
is growing bats. Like it's not the first time, it's probably not the last. Stain is my line where I've brushed has had at least three of my feet by this point. It's fine. Um but I like please you don't need to go now. That's completely fine. Rest up and I'll I'll explain. But it's it, it's a flying eagle lion sort of thing that it's it's disrupted the balance in the forest quite a bit. Does a griffin count as a beast? Yes. Okay. Let me double check that. It yeah. might be a monstrosity. I'm yeah, this is just about. pertinent to how much I can deal with it. <laughs> yes, 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 yeah. Um, just send in Squir- uh, Cyril. He's a great conversation. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's monstrosity, not a beast. Yes. Yeah, no, no, she's just calling it a beastie for that. Um, I, yeah, I can't. Um, griffins are a little bit out. But you're good my... with animals. You might not be able to directly communicate, but you have a come in presence with Cyril, at least. Yeah, but he's been around for oh, ages, and he comes and goes. You know, he's his own thing. I'm... Yeah, I'm, I'm okay, but, you know, I'm more of like a... Take, take, take the evening, get some get some rest. I mean, you've still not quite yeah. recovered yet, so please, have some food and sit and discuss. Of course. You owe me nothing, please. I just please. wouldn't be keen to kill something in the domain of a druid. Doesn't seem quite Well, I'm right. not asking you to kill it, I'm asking you exactly. to Exactly, so in which case got to come up with some kind of other idea of how we deal with it. I vote we sleep, deal with this shit in the morning. Sounds good. Nata. The, 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 oh, uh, sorry. Uh, uh, terribly rude of all no, of no, us. No, um, no. Nata. 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 I'm not hearing the difference. <laughs> Nata. Nata. Never. Yeah, you're right, you got it. Nata. 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 Uh, th- those are two very different things. <laughs> no, this is perfect. Nata. 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 Yeah, Nata. Nata. At this point, I'm going to call you Jane. Right. Um, <laughs> With a Y. <laughs> look, look, look. Um, the, 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 the guards, how, uh, sorry, it was, it was a bit of a haze. How, how far is... Oh, it's about a two-hour walk from here, through the forest. Like it's, right, it's, it's, okay. It's, it's taken up a bit of a domain. It's, it's, you know, it's killing on sight at this point. It's very territorial. I can't get close enough to find out why. Right, so they, they happen to take more or less all, all of our um, uh, uh, funds. Are, are their corpses relatively intact? Well, we did have someone, um, one of Melora's more prolific warriors went out to have a look on my behalf, but sadly they didn't come back. So there might be something if you're raiding a dead body. Hey, I... Alexi, if yeah. you wait a while, the owl barrel poop out some guard. I, I, I'm, um, uh, that, um, no, but thank no, you. No, it, it will. It's an option. It will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It'll pass straight through. through that. Right, then, and again. And just find I, the it, wash it, it off, it, and that would be an experience, Alexi. Uh, I can t- I guarantee you've gold, never done yeah. this. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm quite all right, I feel, for sifting through excrement today. Um, <laughs> uh, wonderful. Uh, never, never mind. You'll have to do it one day. I w- will not. <laughs> you just wait and see. Uh, I want to go home. <laughs> What if you fell in some? Would you, you then have to sift your way out, right? Are we making plans? Are we throwing Maybe. him in? <laughs> if you throw me in poo, I will stab you in your sleep. <laughs> we don't sleep. She yeah. just mouth. <laughs> we sleep far less than you, we, we don't sleep. Right. Uh, uh, um, he's... His way of joking, I'm pretty sure. He's not very funny. No. No, he no work, right? he's working on it. Work harder. Okay. I'm going to go tend to the soup. Discuss, please. You don't need to answer. If you want to go, I will send you towards Eridan or out east, wherever you want to go. Um, but I would appreciate it. It did take a cloak of mine as well, which I would very much like to get. Let out. us know if you'd like any help with the of soup. I, I trust I've got it. And she walks over. And in the distance, she puts the staff down. You see vines, like, taking things up and bringing things in. And she's just gone full, full druid on it. Um, cool. She's helped us. I reckon we should try and help her. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm, um... Hopefully redeem the name of the Filverell somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, I'm in. <laughs> you seem to have quite a bit related to these forests. I didn't realise that you knew. I've, I've, I've scouted around here a few times. There's a few towers we can always hide into if we need to go some safety. Yeah, there's some old sites. Um, I've just, you know, if you're ever being chased. <laughs> I love a chase. Um, then there's uh, little spots that you can... Yeah. Can hide into nice woods. Yeah, very nice. Interesting. How's your shoulder? Are you are we good? Should we? Where's that? Uh, yes, I I uh, need to mend before we move on. But guessing you need to 
rest your weak bodies before we... He says, still with one arm. Yeah. <laughs> Do you now sleep? No, there is little to no requirement for sleep for me. For us either. Same. No, I'm not ah. here, so... All right, I'm just going to hunker down. Let me know when the soup's ready. I like her. Yeah, Milo's going to just be like... And kind of curl up with Cyril, like, <laughs> in a sort of little round. And if I'm able to, um, I'm just going to kind of sit on my own, quietly mending my yeah. arm. So you I can reattach your arm. It won't bring back any hit points, but your arm is now reattached and functional. Yeah. Perfect. Yep. Um, for, the, for the mechanics point, a long rest, you'll get your hit points back and your spell slots and stuff as well. So you do need to rest, even if you don't have weak Perfect. Fleshy bodies. Yeah. Um, cool. So as you guys all sort of hunker down, and Nata goes goes about her work and scratches grouch behind the air a little bit, and like brings out this massive pot of soup and like hands it around and, and stuff. Um, it's still relatively early in the evening, so if you wanted to go hunting and get some extra provisions, you're, like, you're more than welcome to. I'm happy to run a small thing for that. Anyone wants to head out and get some food or some bits? I would but... like to ask Nata if I can stroke the owl back. She <laughs> make a persuasion check. Oh no. Uh, persuasion. I yeah. think I've got a good modifier for that, right? Please. 14. Well, dear, he can smell trouble, so let's hope you're a safe one. Um, but approach carefully, and from the front, they don't like to be snuck up on. And, and I just do avoid so. his back leg. He's a bit, he's a bit sore. So uh, if you walk up and make an, an animal handling check for me as well, please. <laughs> <laughs> 18. 18. Yeah. So he's, he's, he's very um just lethargic. He's full. He's got... You can see, like, his stomach's just Can very... I give some of those next Yeah, scratches? and he sort of, like, he hesitates for a second, and you just have a... And he just, like, falls into it, and he just, like, enjoys it. It's very soft. It's like it's like stroking, like, just a big pile of feathers sort of things, and just, just sort of comes in quite quite happily. Um, yeah, it's good. So you guys are eating, chatting, talking through. Did you want to go hunting, or you want to just leave it? You just, you just straight out. Uh, Alexi will. You want to go hunting? Yeah, he's going to take his crossbow and... Head out into the forest. Sure. All right. Uh, we're gonna do three hours of hunting. We're gonna go bit by bit, and then just gonna roleplay. See so you guys. Just hang tight for a minute. I'm cool. not gonna let him go on, on his own. You so guys want to go together? I'll go with him just to make oh, sure he doesn't die. No, no. Die. Really, I'm I'm more than capable. You, it's quite all right. Do you promise me that you're not gonna die? I I, I promise you that I, I will not shed this mortal coil hunting for birds. And if you meet anyone, will you be polite to them? I will act as if I am you. <laughs> I really want to see that, but you got to let the baby bird fly on his own. Off with you. Um, any special requ- I mean, the, the idea of eating meat is a bit uh, for me, but um, any special requests? No, I'm not fussy either. And I go back to the you owl. You don't bear. eat, do you? No. Fascinating. We must sit down and talk. All right, well, um, I'm just kind of cross over one shoulder. Um, ta-ta. And... All right. Yeah. Um, chances we may never see him again. Cool. Uh, sorry, I'm just getting a thing up. Sorry. Myla's just... been like curled up on the floor, trying sorry. to sort of mimic what you're doing, just being like. How How are you going? How are you going about this? <laughs> um, probably not successfully because it's Alexi. Um, he's going to try and make himself as quiet as possible, <laughs> observe and find either some small game. Cool. Is there anything specific you're looking for, or just a small game? Yeah, like rabbits. If I can find a strange, just make a general nature something. check. That, yeah. Make a general nature check. Did you talk to Saskia about this before, or did you just decide? Nope. That fell Saskia went straight to bed. Yeah. Let me check with the hunter. Look, it's fine. <laughs> uh, oh, that was nature. You say? Yeah. Nature is fifteen. Fifteen. Yeah. So you saw a bit of small game running around. Yeah. You guys can smash them through the forest. Cool. Uh, so we're going to do this in three steps. One, I need a stealth check, please. Go. Eight. Eight. Cool. Uh, so <laughs> almost to spite you a little bit as you ask to leave, Nata sort of like <laughs> makes, finds the noisiest branches she can to announce your presence to the forest that you're coming. Like she allows hunting, but she's just not a big fan of it. So on that query. Uh, cool. And a survival check to see what track you pick up, please. Uh, what's my survival? Okay. Oh. Natural one. Natural one. Ooh. Uh, 
We are never gonna We're see never you again. We're never seeing you again. That's it. I said. Oh my god. Why are you getting something out? Oh. <laughs> I op we op it's been you so nice to go off you. by yourself. Yeah. No, I'm kidding. I, I was gonna. I was gonna Rouch throw, is gonna throw eat you. you. That's, that's way too many. Um. Maybe, maybe, maybe he just meets like a fairy who wants to make out with yeah. him a bit. <laughs> so a natural one. Natural one. Natural one. Natural right. one, baby. So my new character, that's really good. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah, as funny as it would be, I feel like, you know, it's not... Just, like, there. reach under the table, take out, like, a whole... I know, <laughs> put a hat uh, on. <laughs> roll, a, roll a d4 for me, please. Four. Four. Yeah, Great. now I can roll high. Yeah, you definitely can roll high. So you, you scrub through, and, like, it's not going well. Like, the forest is much, much louder than, than you expected it to be. Uh, let's put in some, some noise here. Noisier background for this, uh, but yeah, you come through and you come to a clearing, and you actually found uh, roughly where you guys sort of ran through um, earlier uh, with the uh, with the spiders before. You see the destroyed web, and you look up and you see three spiders climbing up and rebuilding, rebuilding their web. Uh, so, roll initiative. For fuck's sake. <laughs> You rolled a one. I did. You rolled a natural one. Oh my god, that's terrible as well. Six. <laughs> mm. Right, you know what? You're exiled for a bit. So are you, actually. And you. Right. <laughs> I'm not rolling. It's not, not as exciting as the other maps we had. Um, and I'm not even going to give you battle music because this does not deserve battle music. <laughs> <laughs> Is it going to be over that quick? Uh, well, you hope so. Um, Until the mother comes. I, I wasn't I thinking about that, but now you've said that, I actually really want to do that. Damn it, bro. Um, there's always a bigger spider. There's always a bigger spider. Lovely. Um, okay, so what you said, six. Cool. Um, I like to think Rouch and I have progressed to belly. Full a natural belly 20. Now. Great. A 10. And a three. So it's going to go two, and then you, and then the last one. All right. Lovely stuff. Love um, that. All right. So the first two, uh, with your terrible stealth rolls, well, they're both nerds. Great. So both are going to come running up towards you. So you're already they leap out, already pissed off about that. Um, and the first, they're both going to take a bite uh, against you. So first one mm -hmm. uh, is a nine plus it's a thirteen. Miss. Miss. Second one is a twenty-three. Yeah. Twenty-three hits. <laughs> Cool, uh, and it's going to be a. Oh, you're very lucky. It's only one piercing damage, but make a con save, please. Oh no! <laughs> He's going to come like limping out of the woods, like <laughs> fully green, uh, yeah, puffy. God. Yeah. Eleven. Puffs. Eleven. Uh, eleven. Eleven's fine. Second one's going to take a bite at you. It's okay, Natan. Uh, oh no, wait, no, it was already two. Different on that. Cool. Yep. Turn. Okay, great. Right. Fuck. Um, bollocks to it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna stab one. Because this... I'll give you some better music, you deserve that. Thanks. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, I'm gonna... Because this Alexian, he doesn't like being bitten by things. Uh, he's going to stab the one that, that, that bit him. Um, mm, yeah, okay. That is a 14 to hit. 14 hit, 14 hits, and it's it's one hit point, it's a spider. So you go straight through, and you shish kebab straight on, and just slides up, and it's like stuck on your hill. Okay. Legs, it's legs like wiggle for a minute and then it just goes limp. Okay, I'm gonna use my reaction yep. to control it. Great. And make it attack the other one. Okay, so how's it doing that on the sword? Are you gonna like hold the sword and like use it to bite the other yellow and we're hundred percent doing that? Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it rolls an eight plus four, which is twelve, which just hits. So in this really messed up way, yeah. the spider hooks onto the other one. So you're yeah. holding one, it hooks on the other, and then like they're both just grabbed. Yeah. And now you've got like the shish kebab. It's like, you know you get a barbecue sometimes? Yeah. And a bit of like meat or halloumi is like hanging off. That's exactly yeah. what it looks like right now. Great. So those two you've now got. Well done, congrats. Thanks. The, the other one comes running up. Uh, I want to use my movement before the end of my turn, if that's sure. all right, to move away from it. Full movement? Full movement. Full movement. <laughs> in the opposite direction. All right. <laughs> you're gonna come back, and like Sasuke's gonna wake up, and you're just gonna be like... Spider? Spider. <laughs> <laughs> it's crunchy. Yeah, okay, so 35 feet, oh, directly away from yeah, it. Yeah, this is right. Yeah, okay, well, if you wanna be directly in, then we'll keep running this corner. Yeah. So seeing this, seeing his mates get, he's gonna roll, he's not very smart, he's a spider. He's got an intelligence of one. 
he rolls uh, an eight. So he's actually made a smart move, um, and he's going to turn the stuff on the board. Okay. So he's he's here. He's in range if you want to use your crossbow. If you want to have a shot at him. Um. Yeah. You know what? Three's better than two. That is, again, it's a fourteen. Yep. Absolutely. Hits. Crossbow flies out. That's right. Oh, sorry. What happens next? I imagine it. Well, uh, <laughs> Alex just <laughs> sticks the right here in the ground. And... <laughs> <laughs> You're back a, over the shoulder. You're a big hero. Quick look around <laughs> for anything else that's dangerous. Make a perception check. Eleven. Is that no? No, you're fine. Great, uh, <laughs> right, good call, Matt. Well done. Thanks, Matt. Yeah. <laughs> you had three spiders, and your friends get to eat tonight. Great. Um, <laughs> also, one on the way back. Yeah, uh, sure. I need you to do some rolling for me. Uh, because I want to. Um, I need to. I'm going to use the spider blood for Alexi's flask. Oh yeah, yeah, sure thing, possible. sure thing. Yeah, that's that's fine. I'll tell you. Yeah. What that looks like. Ew. Great. 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 Cool. Cool. Um, so well done. So Alexi come back, comes back. Are you, are you proud of yourself, or are you being a bit sheepish about your... Um, you know what? Neither. <laughs> just just very much, like... Uh, I, 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 I found some uh, spiders. What? Well, uh, All right. Spiders. Yeah. Well, yeah. well done. Alexi, well done. <laughs> Better than nothing, I suppose. Right. Thank you. Um, great. <sighs> so, um, there, there's a spider and... Uh, Spider and a spider. That one, that one was a little um, bit weaker than the others. So, uh, but but you're. Oh wait, you don't need to eat. There you go. You can split this shit uh, one. Thanks. Uh, May, maybe. Uh, um, she, she says. Nada? Are the spiders good hunting game? Are they poisonous? Oh, Aww. wow. Can we get that, please? What? Oh, my God. Oh, a little bonus from Sticky Fingers. Thank you. We love you. You're very good. What the um, fuck? It's so cool. It's, 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 it's so good. It flickers. So good. Oh, wait. Actually, yeah. For, for, yeah. What? We all have little marshmallows? No, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I'm assuming Nada tells us that we aren't going to die if we eat these things. Make a nature check, please, because you've hunted in these forests. Ask your friend, dear. 18. They're grand. They're just a bit bland. I'll try anything else. They're, they're a bit stringy, but, you know, thanks for cleaning up, I guess. Oh, uh, you're, 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 you're quite welcome. Uh, I was told recently that when you were trying to be pleasant to people, you get them things, and I figured food was... Did you good. choose the spiders or oh, did they more, choose you? It was more that. <laughs> yeah, I, that is a I, great question. And an amazing question. Mm. Tuck me. in then. <laughs> Didn't quite enjoy that. Uh, Are you okay? Oh yes, I'm, I'm, I'm quite fine. Um, had to borrow one of them for a, a science experiment. So that, that one, I don't know if you want any of the blood, but it, it, it's, it's in here now. Um, so... What experiments? Oh, right. Um, I... Ah. Oh, I've not... I haven't explained, have I? Is this no. about the hemo... Hemomancy, yes. Okay. Right. Uh, so I... You, you have a... Actually, rather similar to your thing with your... You know, being... Having your... And people are a bit... Eh. Uh, so I... I've actually been doing some research into the uses of uh, blood in magic, uh, much akin to necromancy, only it's a lot less using dead people and more and physically enhancing uh, your body and removing diseases and, 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 and so on. How is this like what I do? Oh, because your people don't like the fact that you're sort of doing both, and my family really doesn't like that I uh, do this. You play with dead people? No, no, that's a necromancer. I'm a humanancer. I play with my own blood and people's. All right, it's a bit weird. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit weird. Well, it's, it's you know, how I can... Where we were fighting the, the criminal people and one of them made suddenly was like a puppet. That was me. Isn't that 
playing with dead people. Uh, mm, Correct. Yeah. Now I can see how you'd think that, but That's te- definitely te- playing technically, with dead people. technically, he wasn't actually dead at that exact and moment. It was just the moment he was slipping into death. I can control him for just a few seconds. Okay. Okay. Right. No, it, it it really is perfectly fine. It's it's an it's a new. A uh, vein of yeah. experimentation that Alexis yeah. going down. It, it's it's really really it is just science. Do you have any rules? Uh, what what, what do you mean? Well, tenants and which. Are you going to take my people? blood? Yeah. No, let, no I, that, that, let's well, say not without your consent. So if one of us Could got really hurt, hurt, yes. Would you make us puppets? Um. Well, I mean. If I was Not, bleeding out, would you take my blood or would you try and keep it in? I, well, try and keep it in because, you, yeah, you're, 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 you're clearly better with it in. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. but would it be in your interest to remove blood and keep it? I couldn't, I wouldn't be able to do it with you because you, you don't have any. Um, but no, I wouldn't take anyone's blood and keep it. That would be weird. Except you have blood in your flask. Yeah, oh, that's... And you're keeping it. Well, that, that was the spider's. Yes, but that's did you still ask the spider? Well, 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 no, but they didn't ask my consent before attacking me, so I figured that fair was fair. Did you? I mean, I guess, but look, okay, right. It, 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 it's weird. I understand that. It's a little bit different. Um, basically, it's just hi. <laughs> basically, it's it's just it's just. Oh, a no, form this of... is Matt watching. You. This is, <laughs> no, Nata's, it, it, Nata's, Nata's doing her own thing. It's just a form of science. And really. what what do you hope to achieve oh. by? Playing with blood of non-consenting victims. Oh. <laughs> Again, now when you say it like that, it does make me sound a Sorry. little on the Sorry. villainy side, and that's 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 not. I'm, I started doing this because I figured it might be able to help people. A lot of disease starts in the blood, so if you can cure it before it it spreads throughout the body with a degree of control, then everyone would live longer, healthier lives. And uh, your. Is that to help you too, or...? Oh, no, this is because that, um, the, as you can imagine, based on your reaction, there's like quite not a l- long list of people that want to uh, offer themselves as test subjects, so I have to use myself. Oh, he's got a good heart. Really, he does. Right, I think I think if Mayway was explaining all of this, then she'd probably do it in a way that wasn't nightmare-inducing. I'm not entirely sure about that, but... I've spent enough time with him, and honestly, he seems motivated by education and trying to do the right thing, and maybe a little bit of defiance because his family don't want him to do it, and he don't like them very much. But stealing someone's blood in the name of science doesn't make right it again. So I'm not taking anyone's that's, that's not that's not a probably going to die or, or probably going or to B, die. Not consenting. Hmm. Well, I, you don't have my consent. It's the same as when I take gold from dead people's bodies. Yeah. They haven't said no, so fair game. Well, um, uh. yes, but I don't like how you got there. Um, basically, okay, right, so a, a limited number of times I can control all of you, except you, for a brief few seconds, which will essentially be like you can keep fighting, just for a little bit. Um, and... If you don't want me to do that to you, it won't harm you at all. It's more that it actually more harms me, if anything. If you don't want me to do that to you, just say, and I won't, unless I think we're all going to die if I don't do it. Can I opt out? I will make a note Which of that. Which box shall I tick to uh, opt I, I, out? I'm, I'm recording. Okay. Do you... I'm fine with it. Okay. <laughs> if we need to keep... if. If my dead body moving a little bit longer keeps us all alive, then it's fine. See, that's pragmatism. Don't touch my body, thank you. But if you try to make me attack someone else that is not Mm. needing to be attacked... Oh, no, no, that would be... Then, if I come back to life, I will. That's perfectly reasonable. Can you... practice? What what, what do you mean? Like, could you... Do you, like, just a, a bit so that... Someone could mm. know um, whether it was awful or... Do you uh, know what someone feels like while that's happening to them? No. Okay. So it, 
It could really hurt. Well, well I imagine you'd be unconscious. You imagine? Well, yes, because I can only do it if you're uh, about to die. But that doesn't mean they are unconscious, totally unaware. Right, um, okay. Uh, I, I don't know. We can test it, if you want. I, I just, uh, I mean, I can't do it now because I, I did it earlier and honestly oh. I'm a bit knackered. So, okay. um... Uh, if how, I how long to... do you have to wait until... for the for how, how long does the thing have to be dead until you can work your magic? Oh, no, it, it can't be dead at all. It needs to be, like, either living or just on the precipice. Just on edge of death? Yes. Uh-huh. Is this making more sense now? No. <laughs> I mean, I understand. I understand. Right. I don't know if you do. No, no, I, well, I, I mean, I understand it, but it's an entirely new science, so... It, yeah. It's, it's kind of, it's actually quite exciting that I don't understand. Uh-huh. Um, and, you know, I'm, whether or not it has uh, merit in the, in the future, uh, it, it would be morally irresponsible to not find out. Wait, would that mean other people could do it? It, um, I I honestly don't know. Uh, but perhaps I mean I I did it through years of, of study to get where I am. Okay, because you know you're not a bad person, right? You, uh, you know you said you're not a villainy. Well, it, but yes, I'm, I, I I imagine if I was, I, I I wouldn't have this stammer. But what if someone bad did get it? Oh, then I imagine I would have to kill them. Okay. Who's on barbecue duty? The spiders are burning your bell ends. <laughs> oh, damn, I'm sorry. So, um, just, just for your reference, so you're only to, able to extract from two spiders because the one that used to bite the other one was poisoned the blood of that. And so it's okay for eating, but blood, no, no dice. So just make a note of that. Two, okay. Two units. Okay. Yep. Cool. So, nothing from them. Two units. Oh, two units. Two in the units. Flask. Yeah, yeah, in the flask. Yeah. Thank you very much. Cool. Um, lovely. But yes, yeah, as, as the night's winding down, and any anything else anyone wants to? I would like uh, to uh, s- just try to chat to Nada and understand, just understand her perspective on the Filverell because yeah, yeah, this sure. is not so she's good. she's like you guys have eaten this point. The night's winding down. She's just cleaning up a little bit. Oh, oh dear. Hello. Mm. Hi. Um, I'm sorry to bother you, and I thank you so much for taking care us into your glade. I well, you, just you, 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 you busted right in, dearie. I didn't. I well, yeah, you, you could have, you could have sent us on our way. You call it a lesser of two evils. How about that? <laughs> about that, I've got. I just have a wonder, and I would love to understand where you're coming from with the Filverell and what your perspective is. It, I'll be honest. I spent most of my life there, and this is my first time really out and about, and I just never encountered someone who didn't like us so much. Can Myla be kind of like listening, Make but she's not... Make a perception. Yeah. Are you, wait, you want to be like eavesdropping, like sneakily? No, it's she's sort of there, like, listening, but she doesn't really want to partake in the conversation. Make a perception check, if you're actively trying to listen. Oh, <laughs> Uh, I think my perception's not bad, though. Um, yeah, girl, plus 14. Six. 14. You're going to hear drips and drabs, but it's, I think, I'm assuming you're trying to keep this quite private and, like, not, not make a big deal. Like, Yeah, just whatever she's comfortable yeah, with, you sure, know? Sure, so sure. I'm happy to have as an open conversation around people, but if she is No, she's, she's, then... not, she's not shy about how she feels. I'm not so shy either. She, she's been avoiding eye contact. She, she's pretty, like, she's a bit a bit more fond of... of um, of Milo, because Milo's a druid, unless there's some common ground there. But with you and your particular uniform, there's definitely a bit of a uh, like. So she's been very indifferent towards you, if not slightly. I don't want to say hostile, but just not. not like, but she gets she gets really close to you. She sort of leans in and says, "Dear, how, how old are you?" Uh, one hundred and twenty-seven. Three thousand four hundred and eighteen. Oh my! This this forest it, it does things to you in certain places and. What, what, what do they teach you in that library? That we must defend knowledge yeah. and preserve it sure. and allow anyone to learn who wants to. What about your history? What about where you come from? Uh, we... 
uh, what, what everyone knows, we created our land and we have strong borders, but oh, and we try to use the rylithium to enrich our land mm. and help others. Yeah, that rylithium, it's something in it. It is. It's a broken moon. What is now? Dear, I, I don't mean to be kind, but there are things I understand that I just don't think you've been taught. Now, it's not your fault, but I can't. I can't un undo what's been done and... What been, what's been done? Please. I want to learn. Make a history check with disadvantage. Oh, no. <laughs> and it's disadvantage, I'll explain another time. But... Alright. Huh, a natural 20 and a 14. 14 plus? But no, because it's a history check, which is intelligence, so minus two. Minus two. <laughs> Twelve. Um, yeah, you don't know. You, you don't know what she's specifically referring to. Uh, I'll be honest with you, I was never much of the learning, the book learning. I more enjoyed to speak to people and learn from them. It's such an opportunity to speak to someone who's 3,000 plus years old. Well, dear, it gets old. It gets old out here, lonely by myself. Um, there's a history, and a history I don't think you've been taught. And there's a reason I'm out here by myself in this wonderful place, but this wasn't always a, a forest. This used to be a, a city of my own. Not people, we widows, we don't have a place. We're mostly human now. And so, I can't, looking at you makes me sad. Because we were, we were great at one point. And the Filverell stopped that? Filverell were a lot of things. And they still are. And you see, there's, she's, she's welling up. There's a, there's a bit of a sadness coming through. And I think actually confronting this with you, it's, it's, it's not easy. Is there anything that I can offer you? Oh, no. There's nothing I need that you can give. Just get some rest. We'll sort out, we'll sort out our friend tomorrow. And you can be on your way. But don't... Don't be so quick to assume that you're all as high and mighty as you think you are. I'm sure you're, I'm sure you're wonderful. Your friends mostly seem fine. <laughs> but I, I don't... I don't need you to like me. I'm not here to like you. Just... Learn for yourself. With that big library of yours, there must be one book in there they forgot. Uh, I'm not massive on the reading. I more prefer people. I'm there to defend, not to particularly... And I'm handicapped, the caretaker, not God. Maybe that should have been different another time, but here we are. All right. She, she gives you a bit of a nod. I'm going to finish up here. Why don't you get some rest? You, you look a bit tired. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I will. She nods you off and like... A little bit warmer, but still, respectful, doesn't it? Mm. Cool. Can I? What do I roll to see if that's really an elf? Because 3,000 years old, 3,000 years old is old for mm -hmm. an elf. Um, you can do an insight check, sure, I think. Yeah! I'll really go, old go. for an elf. I didn't know elves an got that old. In fact, I don't think they do. Insight, please be, please have a good modifier. Why am I so bad at this? 14. 14. Lots of 14 tonight. You, yeah, you, you, you think it's still above average for you. Uh, <laughs> sorry, guys, it should be nice. You guys have been doing really well today. Um, you've, been, you've been watching closely, and like, there's nothing, like, she's old, she's been hobbling, and like, there's still a lot of that grace and eloquence, and like, she's not quick to act. Or, like, it's typical elven behavior. Hmm. She still carries herself, that poise still going into her, and this nature takes her time. Like, there's nothing there to suggest she's not an elf. An elf of some sort, but also yeah, looking at her features, there's there's probably I'll give with the fourteen I'll still say there's a little bit more fade to her. The ears yeah. are a little bit bigger, the hair's a little bit more wild. Um the angles are a little bit a little bit sharper in some in some places. Alright. Yeah. There's nothing to suggest that she's not No, that's she's, that's what she's I was not thinking. An if that's what you want. No, I was going more a or cool. fade of some kind, yeah. Right. Cool. Anyone else want to do anything before we get to the resting sections? Myla's mostly just like after the conversation, just kind of gonna like catch Mayway's eye and just be like, "Cool." So, are you guys going straight to bed? Does anyone want to keep watch, or how do you want to how do you want to go about this? I'll keep watch. I'm napped, feeling good. Feeling I'll keep good. watch with Mayway. <laughs> yeah. Pals. I can do the second one because I only have I only need four hours. So, Sick. and Alexi will join Myla for the second one. Okay. So we'll start with we'll start for you two. So, Nathler walks off and says goodnight. Um, Grouch comes and sits in front of the caravan and 
plops down, falls asleep, half as like a big guarding teddy bear, basically. That's a How far away from us is that? Oh, still within like, you know, twenty feet. You're all very near yeah. the caravan. Like it's very close by. Mm-hmm. But very much moved to position themselves in front of the house, I think. So right. as a deterrent more than anything, I think. Um, but cool. Yeah, so the fire's flickering a little bit, the low embers are coming through, and so you two keeping watch. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you can both make a perception check, or one of you can make it with advantage. 16. 16. Mm. Uh, 20. 20. Yeah, you both keep watch, and like the rays are darker, they're dimmer now, and you can sort of make out a few stars coming through, and one of the main moons shining down and on top, but everything seems clear and quiet, and Cricket sort of chirping. You hear a couple of howls in the distance, but nothing, nothing you haven't heard. If you guys want to chat, you can chat, or if you just want to call it, you can call it. Did you know this used to be an elven city? I did not. I feel like I'm learning a lot of things I didn't know today. Yeah. I don't know much about it, but I've heard it was magnificent. Yeah? Yeah. How are you feeling? Yeah. Pepped. Feeling good. Woo! Bring on tomorrow. Let's find that boosty. Yeah, I'm wondering how we're going to deal with that without hurting the thing. I'll be all right. I don't know. Griffin's pretty big. How big? Pretty big. Mm. <laughs> I like birds. It's all good. I'm a fan of animals, not like Myla is, but mm. I don't know. Hoping that we can find some kind of peaceful way. Yeah. Be grand. Cool. And your, your watch sort of comes to an end, and you can stir the next partners if you like. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tag team, yeah. let's go. All right. Mama, you're up, honey. Yeah. Yep, ready. Right. Yeah. Um, just, just a note for you, Guy, you'd be, you were aware of everything happening around you even when you're resting, so. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I don't have to alarm or anything, do I? I'm just, I'm, yeah, you I'm you're, you're, you're just out. You're just out. Yeah, you're good. Cool. I begin to meditate. Okay. Uh, cool. Uh, one with advantage, you all both can roll a perception check. I'll give you advantage. <laughs> Fourteen. <laughs> Fourteen? Yeah. Fourteen. Fourteen. Yeah, so you it's getting a bit darker and like the last sort of glow is sort of just peeking through trees. Almost like God rays coming in horizontally. It's actually quite nice. A small mist rises up a little bit. Um, the stars come through and you hear the beating of wings. If you both look up, you see the silhouette of a large beast fly over top, north, northeast, a little bit of the direction. It doesn't stop, it doesn't pay any attention, just over top with some of its claws. That's it. Carry on. Didn't um, offend you earlier, did I? I, I? I tend to do that, I think. When? Oh, when I liken my um, use of magic to yours. Oh, no. I was just confused. It seemed like an odd comparison. Simply that you're, you were somewhat of a, um, uh, what's the best phrase? Uh, almost like a, a, an outcast because of not fitting neatly into how your society wishes you to be. And it, it's very much the same with me. That's, that's, that's what I meant. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, right. That that makes sense. Right. I just I'm I uh, the, the 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 other Mayway. She she can talk. I probably best that I don't. Uh huh. You you seem to like talking a lot though. <laughs> I, I honestly, my anxiety right now is through the roof. <laughs> okay. So you just you just talk. No, I get nervous. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Yes. It it it. Mm. If you're worried about what you say, right. why say more? <laughs> I imagine it's sort of like a defensive mechanism in that I immediately am aware that I'm babbling. I can't speak. Um, what was the question? <laughs> <laughs> why are you talking? I don't know. <laughs> I guess maybe it's practice. Mm. No. 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 It's 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 it, it's been like this for a while. I, it's just... And it hasn't got better. No. Hmm. 
Is Mayway helped? She keeps trying to get me drunk a lot. Yeah. Does that help? I actually have quite a high alcohol tolerance, so... What does help? I don't know. You need to find out. It'd be a fun experiment, but I've no idea how to even begin with that. Have you tried sort of sitting in nature? Isn't look, that what we're doing right trees? now? Yeah. That right yeah, now. Yeah. It's not working. Just really take it in. Have a squirrel. Cyril pops over. Still completely unaware of your uh, disposition, shall we say. <laughs> uh, just hops up. Wait, wait. Like, Quirk just said that you're a little bit and just shrugs his little shoulders, bounds up, hops on your boot, sits up, looks expectantly at you. I don't, I don't, I don't speak squirrel. I... No, it's okay. So just look at that tree. It's a nice tree. <laughs> look at this Sways tree. a little bit in the breeze. And really... Look at it. Look at the colour of the bark. Look at the way that the bark swirls. Look at all the different kinds of branches. Are they thick branches? Are they thin branches? Are there lots of little twigs? Is it kind of... Sorry, I get excited about this. That's that, that's that's fine. I more get excited about uh, books and libraries and uh, experiments. And yeah. It's a nice tree. Very, very colourful. I'm, I'm a big, big, big fan, honestly. But really, look at it. Really look at it. And see all the... Does it have big leaves, small leaves? Really, really, really look at it. Is there some sort of test? Is that why I'm looking at the leaves? Maybe. Right. No. <sighs> and when... Maybe when you look at the tree hard enough and you've found out every little tiny thing there is to know about the tree, you might feel less... babbly. I'm going to roll an investigation check on the tree, if that's sure. all right. <laughs> because... It's very dark. Uh, yeah, it is dark. That's going to be difficult for me. Um, do I just roll a disadvantage or... Um... You could also get up close to the tree if you wanted and like, feel the tree. Oh, it's not. Looking it's, it. not it's an investigation, yeah. Oh, yeah, cool. I'm going to do that. Then. Yeah, so yeah, just a straight roll. Yeah. So what do you roll first? Uh, dirty 20. Dirty 20, yeah. yeah. So, you know, you, you feel a little empowered and you walk up and you come and... You run your hands through the branches and you give it a bit of a pull and like feel the strength of it and like follow the roots and like you look at like the intricate system of the bark and how the roots come up and like you look at how tall it's becoming, you try and guess at how old it might actually be and you like you get a dagger and you chip away just a tiny bit and you just like feel like the texture and like this thing that falls apart and like small amounts can amass to something so sort of great and, and powerful and you can swear you can see that you can feel Nafa just watching you from the back just a little bit as well, just, just watching but yeah, you take it, the wind blows through and you know what? You actually kind of get it. Okay. Alexi will go sit back next to Marla for the rest of the watch and sketch the tree. Great. The rest of the night happens without incident. Um, last, last bit of the watch. Just you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just using that um, cloth that was rudely returned to me. <laughs> um, just giving myself a little bit of a mm-hmm. polish. Okay. Trying to kind of download the information I've heard of the day. Indifferent. Indifferent. Mm. Okay. Make a perception check for me. Uh, with disadvantages because it is quite dark. Okay. Right, it's the first one to ten. Ooh, second one to thirteen to ten is my advantage, yeah. So, you know, it's kind of hard to make out a little bit. Your eyes play up just a little bit, but nothing mm. seems to come. You don't hear anything coming through. Mm-hmm. Um, but clouds do start to roll over a little bit. And a storm, a very light storm, starts to settle in. It just starts raining a little bit. The campfire goes out. Mm-hmm. Let's my umbrella out. Just I'm just sitting and keep watch. Mm-hmm. Anyway, you, you thinking about anything? Confused by this em- emotional talk earlier, but. Um, yeah, trying to piece together what everyone's up to and why they're thinking the way they're thinking. It's a bit, it's difficult to keep up. You think about one of the first friends you ever made and your relationship with him. And he was he was a bit more indifferent, I think. And uh, you know, 
it's quite weird to be so engaged with someone who's so weird their emotions on their sleeves as much as someone like Milo or someone who can talk as well as Mayway or mm. someone, as, someone as blunt as, as Alexi or, or Saskia they just sort of like say it's, it's, it's a different thing for you mm. um, but there's, there's a comfort in that as well I think you know where you stand more and maybe not trust but for now it might be a fortunate place to be and you sit and the rain carries on and the trees sway Grouch snores a little bit in the corner. Nothing happens. And as the last rays sort of come through and the rain head of patters and eases off a little bit, and you guys start to wake up. Long rest ends. Uh, and we're going to take a break. Right there. Mm. Yeah. Lovely 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 first time. Time. Looking forward to seeing what you guys do uh, in the next bit, but I guess we'll find out. So, yeah, mm-hmm. uh, stay tuned. We'll see you in a few minutes. Thanks so much. Cool. Oh, that's fun learning about everyone. Welcome back. I uh, hope you had a good break. We did too. Uh, so, when we left off, our heroes managed to, managed to evade capture, busted into a strange sunset type glade, meet the wonderful, um, sometimes Scottish, sometimes American Nata. <laughs> some RP <laughs> happened, some secrets were revealed, some risks were taken, um, and now the party comes to. They stir awake after a successful night's rest, um, ready to take on whatever happens the next day in the challenge. So, as morning wakes, as the rain eases off a little bit and D22 lowers the umbrella. What would you like to do? Nata, um, what's that owlbear called? Oh dear, he's a uh, grouch. Grouch. Grouch, okay. he's, 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 I found him as a little cub. He's, he's quite grumpy mm. until he gets fed and then he's quite, that's, that's it, that's his whole person. He eats until And he... is he a pet? Why, 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 why is he chained? What's the purpose Oh no, of no, so the, I, I don't know if you saw, there's a little halfling Mm. Hunter that he was chewing on before. Mm. Um, mm-hmm. Bill, we, your friend Bill. We, yeah. So Bates nah, sometimes he's he's a free spirit. He can go and do as he pleases. But is an owlbear. You don't fight an owlbear. The owlbear fights you. Um, he was the hunter caught him and well, Grouch won basically. And yeah, it's it's a bit unfortunate. I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend tussling. Um, a little scratching of the chin, you'll fall right asleep. But that's it's a little trick from me to you. Um, Good to know. He's yeah. a similar sort of thing to like Cyril. On a bigger scale, I mean sure. relationally. Right. Not. I mean, I'm sure Squirrel would also have have the way with you as well. Yes. Uh, <laughs> while this is going on, can Alex be feeding Cyril some, like, just a little bit of seed or something? Sure, sure, sure. Cool. But, um, yes, yeah, so, no, Grouch is a companion to me. And it keeps, keeps me company, helps protect the forest, and alerts me if anything's going on. If something's really bad, I can have a quick sort of peek through and see what's going on. It's quite fun. And she just sort of, like, her face goes blank and her eyes roll into the back of her head and suddenly um Could I have been scratching Grouch at grouch. this point? Yeah, and then Grouch suddenly starts not on you and gets a lot, lot friendlier. Um, and there's almost like, you know, you haven't been watching Nata closely, there's almost, almost like human-like qualities in the way the way she moves and Grouch sort of like comes along a little bit and, and then so and she's back. Yeah, just like that. How did you do that? Well, um, lots of practice and you need a, you need a bond. It, it, takes, it takes some time. All right, Cyril. Hand stands out. That in. Cyril sort of looks and like. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it took a it took it took a while, um, and you need you need a very strong bond. I'm sure that you and your little one might might manage. Um, but give it some time. Give it some. Time. It took a few years for us, and I've I've known I've known Grouch since he was a cub. He's a tiny little one. So how old is Grouch? Oh, he's he's uh, coming about nine years old now. Nine. Yeah, he's, 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 he's Grouch. You know, he wasn't always Grouch. 
Once he was slouch, and then once he got a bit more active, he got, got more. And then, you know, sometimes we call him ouch, because he does fight people a few times. Sure. And, um, actually, it turns out Grouch is a girl, so, you know, Grouch oh. is sometimes pouch. And then every now and then there's some little babies there. I'm perplexed. Isn't, isn't she entirely confused by the ever-shifting names? No. Right. I mean, it's, it's, more, about, it's more about rhyming sounds. You, 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 <laughs> you do get that. Oh right, so when when it's, it's more if you say just that ch sound, that's, so, that's when so when like, uh, that Grouch like turns and looks looks up. So so when so when when Grouch is mauling on someone and they say ouch, uh, that only encourages. Oh them. yes, I would I, I wouldn't recommend it. Right, okay, just 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 for uh, my own uh, sense of safety and security later on, just in case. Um, is there a repellent sound of such that that we may <clears throat> employ were were Grouch to get a little? I feel like the sound of footsteps running away are usually quite a good. Good well, I am remarkably fast, so that will probably work. Thank <laughs> if you. If there are ever any any baby babies, let me oh, know. Oh, ma- mating season is not for several several months yet. We're in the wrong Fine. season. We're Generally, me. we'll come to winter and then that, 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 that sort of thing. In the colder months, they'll, they'll cuddle up. And... Send me a mouse or something. I'll come back and get one. Uh, a mouse? <laughs> yeah, yeah, just yes, send yeah, yeah, me sure, someone sure, along. Sure, I'll, sure. I'll pick up. I'm a big fan of that idea. He oh. is marvellous. Oh, she. Gender. There. Scratches. Um... Nonetheless, I'm going to go and see you to breakfast. Um, you've got your spider. Looks at, like the child remains left in the fire oh, from last night. Mm. I'm going to put on some 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 vegetarian. I've got some baked some baked goods, a bit of flour and yeah, just like working yeah, rain fun. and stuff. Oh, I'll wonderful. leave you to it. I'll give you about half an hour. Um, if you need, there's a small stream coming through, and you can refill your canteens and stuff. And off she goes and leaves you guys to get yourself started for the morning. All right, we're going to go deal with a griffin, I guess. Yeah, let's do this. Uh, it, it, it does seem the, the, the most appropriate. She has mm. been uh, of assistance. She's, she's been lovely. She's been very kind. Uh, right. So, um, but it, it it's a griffin, and um, they are dangerous. So perhaps it would be advisable for us going ahead to have formed some sort of plan. Sure. Plan. Yes. Now, um. are we going to try and? Um, simply d- deter this griffin and then send it away, or, or is do we think that killing it might be uh, advisable? I think that killing it might be easier than sending it away. But we, I we wouldn't need to know really why like it's there. To... Need to find out why it's there. I'm pretty sure Nata said it was guarding something, right, or protecting something. It's nested. Yeah. Um, I would put a guess at babies. Babies. But it's the wrong mm, the time babies. of year, maybe. I don't know. Oh God, imagine that. Running with griffin eggs? No, thank you. That would be horrifying. Well, we could just throw them as hard as we can away no, from the. No, no, that. Oh right, egg. Yes, yes, of course. They, they. Alexi. They, mm. What? Oh my. <laughs> Any ideas, Myla, how to interact with powerful creatures? Um, I kind of doubt it. Once like, scratches. Yeah, like I said, I'm kind of more about badges. Than griffins, or All right. like a deer, or something like. Griffins are a little outside of my Bit big. knowledge at the moment. All right, I can't have a chat with them in the way that I could with, yeah. Well, else. well, I, just a thought then. Perhaps in instead of a uh, blindly considering options here, we should uh, uh, attempt to get close to its uh, nest, uh, uh, somewhat sneakily if at all possible, and uh, scout out the location and see what the situation is when we're there. I can do that, and I will not be seen. All right, why that, is that? that you're, you're very certain. Mm-hmm. Uh, why? Because I'll be about that big. Oh. Marvellous. Oh. Sure. Nada said that it attacks anyone that comes into its area, so we could do distraction and then someone stealthy or very small could go and have a look. So, question, how do you get this small? Um, I'm a spider. You're, pardon? You're a spider. Yeah. Is that just because you ate the spider, you become what you eat? I you are what you I eat. I eat spider. No, you don't eat spider. That'd be weird. be weird. I mean, it wasn't too bad, a little bland. Oof, it'd be weird. Yeah. What, to eat the wrong? Why a spider? I, I feel like we need more information. Well, because I could be a mouse, but that might be somewhat tempting if there are baby griffins around. Yeah, but also, wouldn't a spider take ages to get to somewhere? Yeah, like... Could you be a fly? 
Jumping spider? Can't be a fly. A jumping spider? Yeah. Does anyone have the ability to become invisible? I've never perhaps? seen a jumping spider, so... Uh, I, I mean, I, I'm, I'm normally pretty good at uh, hiding. Pretty stealthy. Uh, we can all be stealthy, maybe. But uh, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about an extra layer. Oh, right. Um, no. Right. Perhaps it will be in our best interest, though, to uh, get as close as we can to its uh, area and know. figure out what we're going to do from there. Sure, I'm in. Absolutely. If you can think of a quicker non-threatening animal. A quicker non-threatening Maybe something that flies. I can't fly. Oh. That would be... That'd be ridiculous. Right. <laughs> so <What> true. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, well, maybe we start making our way there and think about animals that Myla could become. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Although, uh, bre- breakfast first, I'm quite hungry. Yeah, food. Yeah, it was the spiders that gave me the idea, but... Um... Uh, you're, you're welcome, Ben, I suppose. So, yeah, as, as you guys are sort of up... Anything you want to do? Yes, yeah. please. Um... Yeah, I would like to uh, imbue my crossbow, please. So, the, the, the way um, I see him happening is, it, you know, he feels a bit different this morning. Um, can't really explain it, but he seems somewhat, somewhat touched. Um, and his little sockets and little, uh, little magical heart is just t- ticking away a little bit. It's, there's, there's, some, there's, some, there's some current inside him, which is normally, normally false, but this time it feels something more powerful. So he just um, he fixes his crossbow up, the mangled crossbow. And um, the crossbows, if you'll allow it, when they fire, have a have that almost faulty electrical charge to yeah. it um, as an extra uh, cool. element of attack. And you guys, and you guys watch as he, as he as he fiddles with his arm a little bit in the crossbow section that, that he usually carries. And yeah, there's like a little live wire that you sort of like rewire into yourself, and it just electrocutes just just a little bit. So anytime you use the crossbow, um, you'll get a bonus one d four lightning damage on top of one d six. That comes with that. You still have to hit. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Get across that bridge when we come to yeah. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> Alexi is very interested and just will spend the next however long at Des 22th side making so many notes. <laughs> Mayway is also incredibly interested. Magic as well? Where are you from? I am a, a complex person with no real home. Well, where did you start out your life? I've never seen anyone like you. Uh, I started my life in a warehouse. In which land? A land I cannot explain right now, but my land is interesting. All right. Well, I look greatly forward to further discussing that. And I kind of chuck him on the shoulder a little bit. Sure. <laughs> he feel, D22 feels a tiny bit um, guarded. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. He's if, they, if they ever bother you about stuff that you don't want to talk about, let me know. Thank you. Well, dears, um, it's good. And she, she gives you breakfast, baked goods, and it's breads, and it's, it's a little bit of cheese and stuff in there as well. Um, made from the Albia, because why not? Um, there's, there's, there's Albia cheese mixed in with that. And she gives you just a couple of days rations each on top, just in case you get a little bit of food. Canteens are full, full so you just put two days food as, as a reference if you guys get stuck. Stuck in the wilderness on top of that. Now, um, I do have one request. I, I would prefer it not to die. I understand how these things go. However, when this happened, um, well, it, it took us quite a special cloak of mine that I... If it's still there, and still usable, I would like to have it back. If, if not, I, I understand these things happen. Um, but nonetheless, if you carry on about two hours that way, and she points, it opens up. Go steadily, you'll need to track a little bit. It's in that rough area. Um, you'll find a, uh, an old tower, an old ruin um, of a crumbled watchtower from one of the old cities that used to live here. Like, it'll be a, it should be quite obvious when you arrive, but do be careful. I, as I said, I did send someone um, not too long ago, and well, they did not come back. So. It's recently eaten, so there's that. That, that is true. Um, but as your friend uh, said earlier, then maybe it's more mouths to feed than just one. 
Could there be anything worth finding or exploring on top of said I, beast? I would say in, in the ruin there might be a little bit of something you might come across. And How much are we talking? Cha-ching? Well, I don't know. In terms of our cha-ching, there might be a bit of coin if you're the sort of person who reads from dead bodies. No. <laughs> Make a deception check. <laughs> Disadvantage. Okay. Oh, it's 11. And nine. Plus. No, no, they were, they were the total ones, so nine. Oh, okay, okay. cool. She yeah, she believes you. Ooh. Oh, oh, good. I, you're in fine company, and I, I trust that you'll you'll do the job well. So, all the best. Um, I'll be around. Um, but I can't I can't interfere. I don't feel right. It's okay. Yeah. Got any tips before we go? Yeah. Uh, well, it flies, so do bear that in mind it, right. if you engage on the ground. If it's quite territorial, it probably won't run away if it's protecting something. So. Sure. Don't don't just go rushing in, or it, it won't it won't end well. Um, probably stay on the path. Um, if you start seeing corpses and dead bodies around, then that's probably a good sign you're getting you're getting close. Um, it does like meat, so if it's feeding, if there's a way you want to tempt it, it's probably best with But it, it is a simple creature, so I wouldn't I wouldn't overthink it. I'm sure between the five of you, there must be a brain cell that you can uh, you can use. Actually, I, I I've, I've just had a thought. Do you do you have any um, sort of uh, uh, herbs or um, any reagents that we could use to perhaps um, uh, tranquilize it in some way? And maybe if it is nested there, we could move its nest while it's unconscious. Spider um, poison. Right, but we don't want to kill it, do we? I, I, I'm. Don't think that would kill it, but it would make it a bit more unwell, and we've got them right there. I just think it would be more most peaceful way we can go go about this. And they're quite charred now. I remember, maybe, yeah. Uh, poison likely gone. Also, it wasn't very strong. Mm -hmm. I was able to shrug it off, but 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 I, but I am quite durable. Um, I assume a griffin sure. is going to be even more durable than you, Alexa. Th that that is that is Never. very very possible. <laughs> Nada. Um, Anything around in in your blade? That could well, help? Uh, you mentioned that's that's he's he's, he's he's smart. This one, actually. Now you think about it, she she disappears for a moment, and she she comes back with this this large sort of like purple, um, like like a large flower almost holding from the stem. Like if you've seen like a like um, an unripe banana flower before, she's sort of like holding it from the bottom like that. If you pull this, it will release a, a, a almost like a spore. Um, I can't guarantee it'll put the beast to sleep, but this is probably the closest thing I have on hand without concocting something specifically. Um, so, yes, please, by all means, take a sheet. She hands it across. Put it in the backpack. Um, yeah, carefully. Carefully, yes. Uh, Lexi it's very... has the brain cell. <laughs> uh, so, just, just be honest, you've got a one-time use of a sleep spell. Okay. Um, it's going to be, uh, you need to be within... Like right up close to do it. It okay. can't be from a distance, so okay. you've got to get right up next to it to, to yeah. use it. Gotcha. Cool. Great. Uh, and anything else? I, I I do hope I'm not sending you to your death, um, but I'm sure you're fine. We hope so too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, is... Right. Mm. Bye then. You you mentioned very quickly. You mentioned uh, it would be in your interest to have said beast returned alive state rather than dead. Why? Well, it, it doesn't deserve to die simply for being a beast. It needs to live and protect. It's not its fault it's down here, right? It's been driven. Any idea where we should be moving it to? I would try and chase it back north to the hills where griffins tend to roam. I feel like expansion is what's pushed it down. All right. um, but if there's a relocation or, or something else we can find, I, I'm sure. I'll just find out what's keeping it there. Maybe there's something keeping it around. Mm. Um, but there are some hills near, near Hilltop, near Eroden, where it might, might be better suited to find a new nest. All right. We shall scare off lion bird. Good luck. All right. Uh, right then. Uh, shall we? Uh, thank you for, for, your, uh, for your help. Of course. Um, it was lovely to meet you. Take care. And sort of gestures. And... There we go. Cool. All right. So, a couple of things. Uh, can I get a marching order, please? So, who's going? Who's taking the lead? I'm going to go at the front. By your side. I'll go behind. Yep, with me. Uh, then I guess Alexi will keep an eye on the rope. Okay. So, just so. One, two at the front, Alexi in the middle, and you two on the back. No, Alexi was yeah. in the back. Yeah. Oh, Alexi there. Oh, cool. Alexi take up front. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Great. 
Um, and who would t- like to take the lead in trying to scout and find things? I mean, that should be you, shouldn't it? Yeah. Great. I can track. You can track? Cool. Yeah. So this, this will be a joint effort. Um, but we'll, we'll start, start with you, Saskia. So, first of all, so walking through the forest, it's still early in the morning, there's birds, there's, there's a few squirrels kicking about. Cyril's like, oh, there's more brown ones. It's like, sort of Weird. runs around. <laughs> Sort of runs around after them and like like chasing acorns and stuff. Um, yeah, as the early morning comes through, what what are you doing to specifically start? We're we're time? just we're gonna um, not as point us in the way of north. Mm-hmm. We'll head that way, just keeping an eye on um, on the floor to see if if we any disturbances or something might yeah anything sure, big sure. that might be in the area. But it's all looking pretty peaceful. So you just march on until we hit something. Make make a survival check to see if you you, you notice anything. A survival or a nature check, whichever is better for you. Mm. <laughs> five one? natural one five yeah so natural with with a five every, everything's looking pretty normal the animals are pretty happy it's not it's not like you know like snow white like coming up and doing the whole thing but like not many people sort of come through this way and it seems pretty peaceful at, yeah. at this moment you you trek forward with with a five she's gonna make a move around cool carrying on um so you come through, the, the sounds of the stream and stuff nearby start to disappear and the wood starts to get a little bit thicker. Um, it's been about an hour now, you're sort of wandering, not, not much luck. And what do you think is the right direction? If anyone wants to make a nature or survival check to I will. make a... I'll do, I'll do nature, yeah. I'll do survival. Uh, either both survival or check. with advantage. Survival or what should we do? I've got nature if that's right. Go for it. Yeah. Yep, with advantage then. Okay, so we've got 14. Five. So 14. 14. 14. I'll take 14. Cool, please. cool, cool. So yeah, so with, with the 14, you sort of like stop the group for a second and realise you're probably not going quite in the right direction as she pointed. Um, warning, GPS internal configuration detects we are not going correct way. Sorry, it's taking you an hour for your GPS to let us know that we're going the wrong way. What's a GPS? Internal GPS means I understand where roughly we go. Oh, all right. Feel free to pipe up any time it, you know, beeps at you to tell you we're going the wrong way, yeah? Maybe it takes a while to calibrate. It well, wasn't properly turned on. <laughs> funny. Well, go on then. Fascinating. Where are we going? Perhaps we should reassess our route to go on then. Lionbird. Go on. Reassess. Right. Where are we going? Can I do a perception check? Ah, uh, you can do another nature check or a survival check. Uh, can I uh, oh, cover that at all? Yeah. You want to help? Yeah. Yeah, sure, with advantage then. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go nature. And how are you helping, by the way? Uh, kind of given the... Um, Sorry. No. Given what we know, and especially with us having seen the griffin, what I'd like to do is kind of use Alexi's somewhat sense of nature to figure out... <laughs> if so- we- Sorry. I saw some dirt once. <laughs> <laughs> I looked at a tree last night, and now you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm all about the earth mother now. <laughs> Druid, um, class. Praise Melora. Okay, kind of considering the position of uh, sky, any natural sort of landmarks to figure out if we are going in the direction of the griffin that we saw before it got mm-hmm. too dark. If I can sort of kind of try and piece together that from memory and assist. Sure. Yeah. What did you roll? So D22. Cool. And roll again in case you get an air 20. Two. Cool. So with, uh-huh. your, yeah. so with the dirty 22, your eye starts working in properly new. And you just like adjust the latitude and longitude a little with your internal GPS, <laughs> and so yeah, you find the right way and start like remembering where you're pointed to before and start start pushing through mm-hmm. again. Cool. I feel a bit more confident. Uh, yeah, you you guys start start walking walking in the right direction. Um, starts getting a little bit quieter, a little less a little less bird, a little less noise. You've you've been hunting not in this area but in a similar sort of area before. So if yeah, you want to make I another... when I was hunting, didn't need GPS then. So if you want to make another check for me, please ask me. What check is this? Um, <laughs> survival, isn't it? You're doing survival. Nine. Survival of nature. Okay, no, nine's nine's fine. It's 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 a low it's a low it's a low DC. As you go through, you look up at the canopies, and it's it's quite thick. The odd bit of sun peeking through, but then you notice just like one big crash, as if something fell through very quickly through the trees. If you'd like to investigate that. Six. Six. Um, you get in, there's not much to see. Like, it's clearly, there's a couple of deep marks in the ground, some crushed grass, but you don't really see much more beyond that, beyond, like, something's disturbed the trees above you. Yeah. Any of you can also look at Yeah, I, Alexi will try that as well, just because if he likes investigating things, it makes him feel good about himself. <laughs> Natural 20. Oh. 
You today. You uh, today. Yeah. You got Matt's juju. I haven't even started rolling yet. He blessed me the other day in risk. And I it did. didn't work then. But clearly, this is what's happened. It took a while to, like, yeah. 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 To roll I mean, it was over text, so. So, with your natural 20, and, like, while well, Sasuke is, like, noticing up top, you're looking down the bottom, and because you're an expert in blood, you notice a couple of claw marks where something's clearly coming and grabbed, mm. and a bit of blood on, on that point where it's where that impact is. Mm -hmm. And as you look up with your natural 20, you look in a direction where it looks like more brush has been disturbed. Something's carried it further deeper into the forest. Okay, cool. Uh, I, uh, so I think this is where the... Yeah, uh, guys, I think this is where um, the griffin uh, came down. I can see some blood. I think you can see that as well, Alexi. Um, you can see some, uh, just the disturbances through the bush. I think it went that way. Yeah, oh, you so. are clever. It's, 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 it's that way. Where did you learn such skills? <laughs> wow. So are you two pointing in a different... <laughs> Alexi <laughs> pointing in the actual direction. <laughs> or if possible, if right. Saskia's pointing, he's just going to go... No, 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 you're, you're, cool. How, how, um, how stubborn are you? <laughs> this is a genuine question. You're very stubborn. Yeah. So even if you knew you were pointing the wrong way, would you stick to your guns just out of pride? Oh, I, we'd start this way and then I, you know, it's, it's... Not you know no, 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 no. <laughs> what I want, I want opposed persuasion checks to see which ways you guys. Oh, oh I want to, <laughs> I want to start going the way that I said, but I'll, you know, I'll, you're, you're correct on oh, the way? Yeah, I'm correct on the way, but like, we're going that way. Make persuasion check. <laughs> you gonna be good to me? <laughs> no. no, three. Make persuasion check. This is ridiculous. <laughs> You're not doing well today, Cheryl. Five. <laughs> <laughs> You're both like, no one wants to make the decision. Um, oh my goodness. And then just out of, just out of spite, you both sort of like bear off. You guys follow, follow Saskia just because it's Saskia and like Saskia should know better than DP over here. And then you loop around. Yeah, yeah. You, you, meet, you meet Alexia like 20 meters up. I was like, <laughs> see, I did. It, 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 yeah, it's, yeah, it's yeah, this yeah. Way. yeah, it's this way. You're both right. No, no. Yeah. <laughs> cool. You carry on. It's getting quieter. Um, you're starting to notice more of these big collapses and it's becoming more and more common and almost like spotlights coming through as the forest gets a bit darker and darker. Can I start sneaking? Yeah, we should be cool. Yeah, guys, Agreed. eyes up. Agreed. All right. Uh, group stealth check, please. I'm just going to write down a collective DC. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Terrible rolls here. You're getting a lot of fours now. <laughs> oh. I'm an eight. Eight? God. Thirteen. Cool. Six. Nine. Oh. Oh, my God. I oh, know. Oh god, Rose, well. what did you do? I rolled another natural one. Oh, oh, oh. We're all gonna die, gonna <laughs> die, gonna die. Gonna die. Gonna die. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, that's not a good sound. That was a great sound. We're gonna uh, get eaten by a griffin. Uh, you two. Here, flapping above. Um, And then over top, uh, I need everyone to make a deck save to hit the ground as quickly as possible. Wait, come on. Natural oh. 20. Okay. Oh, stop oh, doing word. that. 19. Oh. I got 23. Nice. Found the good one. 19. 19? Eight. Okay, that's fine. Rose? Um, looking for my save and throw. Deck uh, save. Eight, 17. 17. Cool. You all hit the deck and you, you're like admiring the bark on this one, this one tree. It's like, yeah, let's go. Until like. Alexi like grabs you and pulls you down with you and you like drop to the floor as like not through the trees but just above the griffin flies over top peeking down um, because of the deck save quickly if any of you failed that one of you still be standing or you've noticed and come back in and it flies into the distance right ahead of you you hear the beating wings and it just keeps going keeps going silence all right well we know it's not home now right it's flying in the direction you guys were heading Oh dear. I think it's going home. Right, yeah, no, my sense direction is not tip top. Mine's great. Yeah, well, I believe out. that. <laughs> <laughs> what would you guys like to do? Uh, I would like to proceed Sneakily, in the way we're going. Slowly, forwards. stealthily. Keeping yeah. eyes yeah. up. Okay, so first I need a survival and H check from whoever's leaning to make sure you're going in the right direction. I'll take this one. Cool. Does anyone want to help? Um, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our health. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so okay. so both okay. roll or what one does advantage. That? Sorry. So you can either both roll or one of you can roll with advantage. So you can just help me so I can like roll both, basically. <laughs> no, you don't want to do that. Don't, what? Don't, don't, don't. Am I if, rolling? No. So you can, you can, roll so you can choose whether or not you want to roll as well or yeah. assist. And if you're assisting the person, they get advantage. Okay, I'll assist you and you get advantage. <laughs> How are you assisting? Sorry, I, there you go. How I, are you doing it? Don't know. <laughs> <laughs> um, just, just describe what you're doing to help well, help my analyze. Yeah, what would Saskia be doing? Is using her knowledge to help Saskia. Oh, my you, no, my, my <laughs> too many people. <laughs> um, just eyes up continuously. This one's always distracted by bloody bark. <laughs> so uh, I'll just That's a nice I'll, tree. I'll keep. <laughs> it was a great tree, though. So you're literally you're like. I'll keep. Yeah, eyes up, and yeah. yeah, if she needs, to, if we need to hit the deck again, I'll, I've got you, right. babe. You're li- literally holding here, like, no, 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 this way, this way, no, no, no. Like, it's like like blinders on a horse, right? Like, yeah, just looking straight yeah. ahead. Better. Sixteen. <laughs> Sixteen. Yeah, yeah. Sixteen. Like you managed to come through. <coughs> Dead silent. You get that idea. Animals don't come to this area for a very good reason. You're finding more corpses. Dead deer, pigs, no spiders, weirdly. It doesn't, you know, I feel like, who would eat a spider? And you guys just sort of come through, but no, no animals, more crashing into trees. And then you can see a slight light in the distance as it looks like the tree line's starting to clear up just a little bit. Uh, stealth checks from all of you, please. If you are stealthing. Yes. Uh, I'm going to swap this dice out. <laughs> oh, spiders. 13. <laughs> you should not have swapped the dice out. Ooh. Natural 13. One. 13. 16. You fucking yep. cockwomble. Rose? Um, one second, adding uh, 13. Gosh, 3 13. 40, 41. Guy? 13. 13. Okay. Natural and that one. one. So, it's despite. So you, need, you, need to, you need to do Holly Man. This tree is way too distracting. You managed to pull through and nothing really nothing really breaks. Saskia, luckily, pulling you away from, from the slight slip down you would have fallen into, which would have made a big pile of extra leaves. Now you'd be always be creep to the edge of the clearing. Um, and you have a look through. And in front of you, and I might as well do this now, um, you see you see the ruins of a tower that probably stood up. Most of it's collapsed at this point. Um, okay. We're fine, we're fine. And in front of you, you see... Mm. Oh. Collapse of an what old tower. Yes, and one fallen tree. And mm-hmm. one fallen tree that's been found. Very cool. Sick. That's yeah. amazing. Oh Old ruins, bricks. This has been left for probably a few hundred years at least. Oh, there's another fallen tree over there. It's oh, a tomb. <laughs> yeah, the Griffin landed there. Yeah, true, yeah. 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 Good, cool. And I all of it. you, on the edge, you're not actually you're on the tree line at the moment, looking in. Still covered at this point. You don't see a Griffin. You don't really see anything. What would you like to do? Do you want me to go and have a look? I can... I'll turn into something small. Go have a look. What do we decide? What, what should you become? Uh, you're I'd going to become a spider, right? I, I can be a spider. Right. Or a mouse. That, that, that. Rat? I, a rat? I think... A squirrel? A, a squirrel? Well, probably... We've, we've seen some of those. So a that, flying that be, squirrel? You can't she be flying. Do fly. That's ridiculous. Wow. I just want you to fly. Uh, I, I, we have seen more squirrels, so I think that would blend in a, a little better. Oh, so you want a brown squirrel? Yes, it's it's like that one, only brown. And Alexi will just point at a bit of his studded leather on his arm, just to kind of like help. I don't really like being non. Not my. Okay, okay, okay. It's, it's only it's only it's only temporary, Fine. and you'll be straight back. Fine. And you if only one. If if you do come across any trouble, um, either try and get back to us, or we'll be very very loud. I'm a squirrel. You could just turn into yourself and scream. Yeah, true. Okay. <laughs> Myla's gonna like start going, going like this. <laughs> and then just okay. laugh and be like, yeah, poof, squirrel. <laughs> so you watch as she sort of like does a weird little dance and I'll say, tiny little, looks like Cyril almost. How does, what does it look like? Yes, it's a, it's just a sort of brown uh, squirrel, but it's she's given it little like white tips uh, to its ears um, in defiance. Um, <laughs> and it's got blue eyes. In, in defiance, I like, I like that. 
Whatever well, makes you like happy, it. honey. <laughs> cool. Aww. What would you like to do? I'm going to run, run on round into that. So Straight on miter in squirrel form. So you, you sort of hop in and you... I'm going to stay in like little cracks and things if I can. So you want to like <clears throat> dodge, dodge in around. Cool, make a stealth Yay. check for me, please. Um, I've got your, your modifier here. Band. Yeah. Um, That's a plus three to stealth. Plus three, cool. But me, seven. So because there are no other animals around. Yeah, I'm a fairly obvious squirrel. You're a fairly obvious, like any yeah. sort of movement. Yeah. Um, you don't see anything yet, though. Oh. It's fine. But you're, not, you're not being like the most subtle about things. You sort of make oh, your way through. You hop through. You come around. And you come around the corner. You see two things. You see the body of a rather, by this point, quite rotten dead griffin with a large javelin sticking out of its chest. Um, next to it, you see the body of a dead half-orc and now quite mangled, rusted plate arm. Um, next to it, with several scratches across across her face, dead on the side as well. Oh. Um, you can make an investigation check if you'd like to know yeah. more, but you are a, you a are squirrel. A squirrel. Um, but you have your own intelligence for making these things. I do. Yeah, so yeah. that's, yeah. Um, um, investigation or medicine? Medicine. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. I mean, it, oh, Jesus, I'm just rolling so badly today. Twelve. Dead body. It's it's not fresh. The, both bodies been dead. Like the the griffin in particular is quite decayed, and the 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 state of both of them are quite like weather and everything else is definitely cool. Yeah. Does it look like there's been another live griffin around in the meantime? You would need to go further inside to find out. Okay. For the record, this is all very open, so sun's pouring, and it's not dark. Mm -hmm. You can you can see, but with your quite small size, you need to get closer to the back. What would you like to do? Yeah, go on. You've got, you, go on? Yeah. Stealth check, please. I can't remember if I can... Can I cast spells in my... I think I can't yet. Not yet, no. In my wild shape. Oh, no, I Oh, wait, can. no, I think, no, I, think I, can. I can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Can you? Oh, I think I can. Let me double check. I can yeah. already I hear people typing angry comments. I know. Know. Just, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't played Druid oh, before. Have rules. I'm sorry. No. <laughs> I haven't played handbook here. My goodness. <laughs> that might help. Yeah, actually, yeah, if you wouldn't mind double checking. Um, um, am I right in thinking this is wild check? Uh, yeah. This is wild check, yeah, thank you. Hang on, I've probably got it. No, that's no problem. I feel like she Retain can. Retain all of your skills. Do, 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 do. Cost I can't cast spells. spells. Yeah. yeah. Until later, I think. It's, yeah, uh, but yeah. it doesn't break my concentration on no. the spell I've already cast. Cool. Cool. Fine, I can't cast guidance. Cool. Then. It's been about five minutes, <laughs> so you've still got. What she said. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Checks out. Thank you, team. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Cool. So um, you're gonna you're gonna stealth then? Yeah. Yep. Cool. All right. And what what just while she's done that, what are the rest of you doing? Watching. Much better. <laughs> Trying to watch after the squirrel. squirrel. Probably lost sight yeah. at some yeah, point. Yeah, you lost sight pretty pretty quickly. Keep Dirty twenty two. Dirty twenty. Ah, oh, apparently just changed the name of the show, guys. I love I love it so I really do I love it so much. <laughs> so you come <laughs> around the side. You hop up over the body. With me. <laughs> you hop over the body of the dead griffin, and like you blend a little bit with like the quite rotted muscle feathers out of there. Lovely. And as you come around, you do spot feeding on a freshly killed deer, ripping, ripping away in a what appears to be like a makeshift nest. Is a well, it's back to you. A large Whoa. griffin. Griffiny boy. Which I'll just hold up for you, so you can all get. Nice. Oh, very nice. nice. Love it. Hasn't noticed you yet, as far as you can tell. Okay. Just in the back corner, just just feeding in, in a in a mess of like old cloth and hay and sticks and carrion and dead bones and just seat seated quite happily and just just snacking. Are there any? Can I see any sort of nest? It's in, oh, it's, it's, in it a, nest. it's it's in a nest at the moment. Cool. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm gonna. Head on back. Stealth. Natural 20. <laughs> <laughs> Light as anything. <laughs> back with the others. And? Oh, she's back. She wants us to follow her? It's all right. I had a bonding moment with a squirrel earlier. Uh, th there is a griffin that's in there that, that's, that's eating. And it, we, um, the, the second bit again. It's not looking our way. 
<laughs> Could you please ask the squirrel? I don't know if I believe you. Is there any babies? <laughs> <laughs> okay. As much as a squirrel can look at you like... <laughs> it shakes its head. No. No babies. No babies. What happened to you on that watch last night? This is... I, 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 um, I sketched a tree. Whatever works for you. Amazing. All right. Uh, do you Mal- want to... Back to you. Mala, should we follow you? All right, let's go. Look. Trust the script. Sneaky, sneaky, guys. Sneaky, right. sneaky. So, just before we... Because, you know, it's a fuck off Griffin... Um, how are you guys going about this? So you've, like, you can see it's, it's a, quite an open area. You can come in from either of the sides. You can come up over rocks. You can come straight into the lair where the other dead body is, which I just put like a couple of markers down for. Like, mm-hmm. what, how would you like to approach this, basically? I'd like to climb up, if I can. Uh, on which, which side? On your... Can I get into this, this, this like, lighter right. colour rock here? Uh, up yes. here? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yes. So if you come up, you will have a view yes. on top. Okay, so I'm going to need a... Actually, no, I'll say you've got a free... That's fine, I just need a stealth check from you to make sure stealth. you can actually... <laughs> I just had an image vision of Mila and Squirrel for me. Eleven. Like... Eleven <laughs> stealth. Eleven stealth. Okay, we'll come back to that. Okay, you... <laughs> Great. Great, you're up there. You can borrow a, borrow a dice cool. if you want. Alexi, what are you doing? Uh, Alexi is going to draw his rapier, yeah, but, and, but also kind of like have the flower ready as well mm-hmm. and he's going to stealth up to the rocks and um, the part of the tower on the left hand side and just kind of try and pin himself against the wall so wh- whereabouts uh exactly where your pen is just you want to tuck in place. tuck in here no no um outside closer to me on the other side of that wall yeah. perfect mm-hmm. yeah. so you guys watch as Alexi sort of anime runs through and just sort of like comes <laughs> and just yeah. like slaps himself against the back with the rapier ready to go cool Anyway. I'll follow Alexi. Uh, cool. Stealth check from both of you, please. Oh. Nice. Uh, 23. Easy. Um, how stealthy? Um, uh, 14. 14? Okay. Yeah, fine, fine, fine. It's, um... Yeah, no, you both you both managed to make that. Uh, cool, D22. I'd like to just uh, creep up uh, on the right-hand side behind the, the block of the walls here. Yeah, uh, yeah keep, keep going for, Yeah, just so I can peek out through the left-hand side and yeah, just see him, sure, but in sure, cover sure. still. Yeah, so you could, if you peek around, you can make out the group. But yeah, but most of the time I'm kind of behind. Cool, not, cool. Um, you're far away enough away that you don't need to stop for that. Cool. Myla? Um, Myla is just going to, she's a squirrel. Like, she's just going to head... Head on in and try and sort of get like as close as she can. Cool. You're getting in there, so I'm going to need a stealth check, please. Yeah, yeah, cool. You know, if they see me, it's really not that big a deal. Uh, plus three for squirrels, right? Yep. Seventeen. Yeah, fine. for squirrels. <laughs> so you bound up, and you're you're on top of the body, just sort of watching a little bit. Now. Um. <laughs> let's let's see. Because oh. mm. everyone else is behind except for you. Sasuke isn't isn't standing there, by the way. <laughs> she's okay, doing... so what are you doing? Yeah, she's she's not just like da, 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 <laughs> like you know. No, like, but are you are you lying? Like, if you there. can't see are me, you... I can't see you. Type thing. <laughs> are you lying prone? How are you? How yeah, are you absolutely. Prone? Okay, she's, so you're yeah. you're flat on your belly, stomach. Belly belly flat. Yeah, cool. yeah. Still. Have you got any weapons out, or are you you literally um, just at the moment? No, but th- she's her hands itching to grab the bow if she needs it. Okay, cool. So. All right, I'm going to roll a perception check with the griffin to see what happens. Oh, it's a shit. plus five. So. There we go. Here we go. So you crawl up, and you're making a good job of it, and then as you get up, a couple of loose rocks fall out from under your feet, and it stops, and it looks up. Make a deck set. Oh. Mm. So throw yourself flat. If this goes well and you're prone, okay. we'll call it okay. 14. 14. No, 16. Those are your saves. 16. 16. So the griffin looks up and doesn't quite see Sasuke suddenly flop, chest flat, prone on the ground. So very lucky. Thank you very, much. <laughs> very lucky. Um, as far as you know, none of you have been seen. It pauses for a second, it looks around it, and he just goes straight back to his like sort of snacking a little bit. Right? Fuck it. Right, no guts, no glory. Uh, Alexi, having the plant in hand, will kind of just look at Mayor and be like, I'm going to need you to stay very close and cover me. All right. All right. And will kind of 
because I don't think I can up. see Sasuke from where I am. Um, cool. Um, but kind of just if he can clock the eyes of other ones, just kind of like. D twenty two says, <laughs> and I am going to regret this immediately. Mm-hmm. But I would like to try and get close to the Griffin and use the sleep on it. So just want to point out again, you need to be within melee distance. Yeah. Yep. I could try and grapple it so that it can't hurt you while you try and do that, but it could go very wrong very quickly. All of this could go very wrong very quickly. I feel like there was some kind of tougher plan. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but I don't... I, you said it now. All right, that's... Uh, if you want to no, help, this is your go, chance. If he's going forward, and then, yeah, as right. he proceeds forward, I'll go with him. Cool. So you come past, and you guys get a better look than, um, than uh, Myla did. Jesus, um, and you look, and there's there's a bit of stuff left around the dead body, and like some bits of. I'm just pointing that out um, for drama's sake. Uh, so you come in, uh, right? I need a stealth check from both of, both of you, please. Um, it's quite a high DC because you are sneaking up on it in its home. <laughs> just just saying. Come on, come on, come on. Nineteen. Okay. <gasps> nice. I rolled another natural one. Right. Oh, Rose. So. <laughs> Here's how this is going to go down. Someone get me a priest. <laughs> <laughs> go on. You come in and, like, quiet stuff. You, you're watching, like, you've dealt with monsters and, and beasts before. So you come in right around and you actually manage to, like, tuck yourself in the side here. Mayway trying to imitate you is busy getting ready for a fight, getting a shield mm. out, and, like, slightly her sword s- slips out and just bangs against a rock. Mm. The griffin stops. Mm. Yep, and it reverberates. And you all hear it. The griffin stops, drops its meal, turns around and screeches, um, looks straight at you. I'm not so great with this thing yet. Need to roll initiative, please. Just me? Uh, everyone needs to roll initiative, but it's only seen you so far. Oh, great. Uh, stealth check from you, though, please, because you're... 19. Cool, you're fine. Betray yep. me. I was like, mine? No squirrel. <laughs> 14. Two seconds, please. Uh, initiative is gone. Do a little sound like oh boy, who saw this mm. now? <laughs> right, I could have uh, rolled well, you don't know. Saskia. 14. 14. Alexi. 10. My way. 19. T22. 17. Uh, Myla. 8. Eighteen plus two is a dirty twenty. Griffin goes first. <laughs> and that does make a sort of plot sense, doesn't it? <laughs> so upon turning around, it immediately it was quiet, it drops everything and it stops and it raises its wings right up and puffs its chest down and <laughs> <coughs> I was about to say, your voice. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, that, felt, that felt good, but it didn't feel good. Uh, so it, it rears up on its hind legs and gets right to the edge of the nest, but it does not leave it. It gets right up and it's going to try and do an intimidation check against you, please. So uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to roll a d20 on intimidation, um, and then we're going to see if you can do a wisdom save against that, whether you're going to be frightened or not. All right. Specifically, holding its territory. So. All right. Uh, that's a natural two. <laughs> it I looks, it looks startled. One. Like you can see the fear in its eyes, and it tries to look big, but it, it won't get off its nest, off its perch. Its legs are up, and it stands up, puffs itself up. Um, make a wisdom save, just in case you roll another net one. Not that you do something like that, but we're going to see what happens. I've already rolled four today. Sixteen. Sixteen. Yeah, you stand your ground, you you plant your feet, and that's that's fine. Like not even shaken by this. Um, cool. That's its turn. It's holding its ground right now. Mayway. Uh, how close am I? You are, you are, I'd say within 10 feet. Yep. All right. Um, I'm going to throw my chain flail forwards and try and grapple a creature so Alexi can get so it close. So you want to throw it and try and tie it up, yeah? Yeah. Cool. Yep, that. absolutely. I'll, I'll, I'll 100% enjoy that. Um, yep, make an attack roll, please. All right. Uh, nine plus six, fifteen. Fifteen, okay. Uh, also, it's a DC to, you have to uh, make a save. Yes. DC fifteen. DC fifteen, yep. As well. Cool, lovely. Um, so it's quite a large beast, it's going to try and just power 
Yeah, it's going to try and it's going to hold his ground, try and power through it. It's going to be a strength saving throw on that. Uh, it rolled uh, a nine. So the chain flies up and holding its own, still puffing its neck out, and the chain flies up and wraps around its neck and then locks in place. And you've, you've, you've caught it. Do my best to hold it down. Yep, cool. Uh, make a strength check for me, please. Already? <laughs> yes, already. <laughs> 11. 11? Yep, fine. You've got it for now. Great. Anything else you'd like to do? Would you like That's to try and move? You've got to help. That's my turn. Cool. You are locked in, though. Like, you can't. Yeah, yeah, uh, cool. yeah. I just want to, in the way that I'm staying, it's not moving either. Great. Cool. Lovely. Love it. Uh, D22. Um, so I've, I've got a, a grappling hook on me still from before. Yes. Am I able from where I am to try to um, project projectile that? To, you want to try and launch a grappling hook to um, try and add yeah. to the to, 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 to try and latch it onto him so we can try and keep him down. I, I like the idea. I'm going to say as part of your action, it's going to take you an action to tie the grappling hook up. So if you want to take an action to prepare that yeah. and get yourself in a position, 100%, but not all in the same turn. Gotcha. But if you want to move and, and prepare it, yep, 100%, I'll yeah. allow you to I'll, I'll, to I'll get my, myself then, yeah, cl- closer in there and start to, uh, yeah, start to. So to you want to be like right inside, come out into view. Yep. Yeah. Great. Cool. So I'm going to have you here. You've sort of got a little bit of cover behind the dead griffin and like this little battle scene that played out earlier. Great. And you guys watch as D22 comes out. He pulls a grappling hook out. And he's like attaching it to the crossbow and getting a rope and like doing something. You're not sure what yet, but it's very cool. Like that a lot. Anything else? Uh, that's it. Good. Cool. Yeah. Great. Saskia. Um, from here, can I see is there, if there's anything in the nest? Uh, make a perception check. You can either make a perception check or you can go down and look for yourself. Um, you have seen that the... the the griffin is tied up at the moment. Yeah, I'm gonna go down and see for myself. Sure. Thanks. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yep, you can get there. Um, you need to make an acrobatics check. Just make sure you don't fall off this. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Nine. Nine. Wait, acrobatics check? You're good with acrobatics. Yeah. Yeah, she's just better roll. Oh, <laughs> <can't> roll. <laughs> <laughs> you stumble a little bit, but like it's it's like a ten foot drop. You tuck and roll out, and like twist your arms. Tuck but and you roll. Don't, yeah, you don't, don't take any damage. So you get it takes all your movement to get there, and you get to the nest, and Griffin notices, but it's currently tied up by yeah. by Mayo at the moment. You find um, you can make an investigation check if you want to have a thorough search, or a perception check if you want to have a quick glance. Um, if you want to do some combat, you'll need to have a quick glance. Um, he's quite. So the Griffin currently has... The Griffin's currently tied up by Mayway's got just, it wrapped up. Just by Mayway. Just by okay. Mayway at the moment. Um, yeah. So if I'll do a quick one then, so that's mm. perception, yeah? Yep. So it's not a very thorough look, it's a quick glance through. 11. 11. Oh, so yeah, with 11, you know it's the same sort of debris. Um, you haven't really looked properly yet, but you do see in the middle one large speckled brown egg about the size of a rugby <laughs> yeah, yeah. ball. You said there was nothing in there. Okay. Um, from here, can I, um, I'm going to hide. Yep, I'll allow yep. that. Whereabouts? Um, just... You mean you haven't got much baby. movement, so you can bury yourself <laughs> in the nest if you want to as an action. So it, yeah. So yep, yeah. cool. So, so jump so in and cuddle them. Alexa, you look, you see you see um, Saskia run and take a quick look, see the egg, for Dive fuck's sake. And she just like dives in underneath the refuse and a couple of skeletons. Um, make a stealth check just to see how effectively you do it. <laughs> You're not rolling your own dice anymore. No. <laughs> <laughs> eleven. Yep, eleven. All right. Um, the Griffin's a bit, a bit distracted. Yep, it rolled an eight. That's fine. So yeah, you go and you quickly just pull on as much as you can. It's like muck and filth and bird shit and guano and you're in there. You're prone. You're on the ground. End of your turn. Yeah. Good. Good move. Good move. Uh, right, Alexi. All right then, uh, given that this thing is tied up and it's got the chain around its neck, Alexi is going to sort of sprint over, slide under the chain, stand bolt upright and just like lash this flower in this thing's face. You're just going straight in with straight the- Straight in. Cool. So are you getting right right in here? Yeah. Right against it. Great. Uh, roll 5d8 for me, please. Mm. Can I borrow 2d8s from someone, please? If you know which ones they are, you can have which ones. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you want them from? Oh, thank you very much. I've got one here as well. Oh, I'm alright, I've got one. Oh, cool. Yeah, I've got five. <laughs> alright, that is five, ten, uh, seventeen, nineteen, twenty-one. Twenty-one, okay. So you watch and you pull the flower and like it's quite intuitive and you sort of like point it up and you pull it back. Thank you. And it explodes out and it's like 
almost like gross white brown dust comes up into the griffin's face and it and it looks a little bit sleepy for the moment as it's it blinks a little bit um and it doesn't make its con save however it's just knocked a bit of health off it wasn't enough to knock it out completely to sleep so okay. it's a little bit drowsy and it lo almost looks drunk on the spot a little bit as it sways a little bit and starts trying to pull pull away but it's done a little bit of a little bit of damage but nothing beyond that at this point the griffin's still awake and still conscious all right then alexi seeing that this is probably going to go to um actual fighting pretty soon i imagine mm -hmm. uh draws his rapier and as he draws his rapier he closes his hand around it and slides his palm up the blade mm -hmm. and from the sort of red it suddenly erupts into lightning cool um. great uh that's my bonus action i have to take some damage you have to take some damage it's four points of damage four points of oh, damage wow so you watch as this as 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 he comes in he slices his hand mm -hmm. open and suddenly this and just like lightning starts to like pulse yeah. and hum around like up, up and down yeah the looks similar to day 22s <laughs> except it's red yep and the griffin's now just looking like quite fearful between the two of you just like trying to like pull away a little bit um my life. Okay, I'm gonna run as a squirrel up to. I can't quite see where I am. Uh, you are. Uh, you are. Uh, yeah. You're cool, in, yeah. So here, yeah. I'm gonna squirrel on up. To you're the, a squirrel, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna yeah run on up to like just underneath like where the griffin is. Um, um, actually, if I can get behind it, that would be great. I don't think you got the movement for that unless Fair. you want to dash. No. Okay. I just want to scoot as close to it as three, I can. Three. You, you can get, you're right and underneath it, so we'll say you're under the wing at the moment. And then bonus action, no yep. squirrel anymore. Um, <laughs> yeah, just suddenly like... Um, and then I'm going to... Yeah, let's... Um... I am just going to thorn whip it. Great, cool. In an uh, attempt to sort of like also kind of pull. Cool, is um, that a save from me or is that a straight roll? It is a straight roll. Um, so yeah, just... Go for it. Cool. Uh, what is that plus seven? 12. <laughs> 12, 12 to hit? Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's just hits. Oh, yeah, sweet. it's a big beast without, without any armor, so... Cool. Yeah. It's gonna do a tiny little bit of little bit of damage. Oh no, six 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 points of damage. Great. Um, is it a is it a large creature? It is a large monstrosity. Yes. Okay. So I can pull it towards me, I think, but it would be like ten feet towards me. So you can you can try and restrain it the like same way. Like, that, yeah, exactly. The same that Mayweather yeah, also that was tried to do. I'm aiming cool. For. Was it was it six damage? Did you say? Yep. Cool. Uh, cool. Great. Uh, and do I need, to, I need to make a strength save on it, don't I? Or is it just, it's just on it now? Yeah, so Milo's just there with like loads of sort of brambles and stuff, all kind of like up around it, pulling it. Nice. Down. It's pretty cool. Cool. Great, because it's, it's turn now, so let's just see. Oh dear. Oh, we're going to make strength savings for his in a second, I think. It'll be easier though, if a few people have it. Yeah. Yeah, so so no, there's no there's no save from me, you you've just got it. Yeah. Um so yeah, thorns are rough on the ground and now tied and it's like sort of torn between the two and you guys are both sort of keeping it down. Great. So the griffin seeing Snaps. this is going to try and take off. Uh it's going to roll a strength check. Um it's gonna be opposed against both of you, so I'm gonna need strength saves from both of you too. Big strong. I'm afraid. Okay. I'm actively afraid. You've got this. Nice. Hang on. 17. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> so, that's a four. That's a four, okay. So, what'd you roll? 17. So, combined, you guys had a 21. So, I rolled a 19 plus four and a 23. Oh, so, here's I'm what's gonna happen. I'm sorry. The beast it's flaps right. its... We don't wanna hurt it. Flaps its wings and it takes off. The thorns just break quite brittle, it doesn't hold takes off into the air. Now, as a reaction, you can let go, mm -hmm. or you can go with it. Three, two, one. I'm going one. with it. All right, cool. The griffin <laughs> flies straight up into the air. 
You'll um, get knocked back a little bit. Would I have an attack of opportunity? You have an attack of opportunity, yes, as do you. As do I, yeah. Cool. Uh, okay. Don't hurt it! <laughs> <laughs> Here's a question. Yep. <laughs> that's, that's how we always love to start a. Oh, uh, I'm going to I haven't got a platform, sorry, because um, but yeah, no, we're that, about we're roughly about here. Yeah, we're quite I'm high. Yeah. gonna die um, from hitting the ground. Can Alexi stab his rapier if if I hit into the Griffin and essentially try and go with it? If I can maybe help my way. So you want to stab it and hold on, yeah? If possible. Okay. Yep. You can do that. You need to roll uh, a 19 or higher on your attack roll to pierce your rapier through it and have enough purchase to make. As in, have 19 in total with the modifier or 19. Yeah, yeah. With modifiers, yeah. You need to roll a natural 19. Okay. Right. That is 17 plus five. Yeah. So yep. So you quickly, without thinking, you take the rapier yeah, straight in and. and Screams out of pain. I can get damage on that as well, please. Uh, yeah. The Griffin takes um, six plus five, so 11 piercing damage and four lightning damage. Four lightning damage. Oh, and four lightning damage. Yeah. So, okay, cool. Because my blade is. So it's shocked a little bit and it comes up, and then you hold on and I just make a strength save as well as it takes off. Yeah, and and it, so this arm... is where I immediately yep. fall back down. We'll get to you, sorry, Mom. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. Natural 20. <laughs> that's five! That's five! All right, well done. I've never rolled this many ever! Great. Yes. Um, I'm like just going to try to hit it with a dagger. Yeah, I great, much. great, There's great. There's not much I can do. Um, oh, nice. Dice, you've redeemed yourself a bit. Uh, so that's. 12 to hit. 18 hit, 18 yeah, hit, yeah. 100%, 100%. Cool. And then that it for a whopping five points of damage. A whopping five points of damage, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool, great. Just uh, like, <laughs> okay, we're done. Sweet. So, yeah, that was its movement. It, it takes off into the sky, and as a full action, what it's going to do, it's going to go down and try and bite the chain. I'm going to try and bite through it. Um, Isn't it around its neck, though? It's wrapped around its neck, it's changed, so it's going to try right. and snap at it, so I'm going to see if I can make a... Right. I don't have an AC for my weapon. Uh, I do, so you're fine. Oh, great. Yep. Yeah, great. Thank you. Uh, it, is, it just misses, so it grabs it, and it tries to bite through, and it can't, but what it's going to do, it's going to like start swinging around wildly instead. I need a strength saving for you, from you, please, to, to stay, Still. to keep holding on to it and not slip right. off. Um, you're fine at the moment because you're being swung wildly. 13. <laughs> Sorry? 13. 13. Or what a 12. You you just you watch as Mayway with one arm sort of like grips the other and just sort of like holds on like with every last bit, like your arms are on fire, it's really hard. But you're being whipped back and forth and you're doing just fine for now. Cool. Uh, right, that's the end of its turn as it's like swinging you around. Mayway. Um I'm gonna try climb up the chain. You're gonna try climb up the chain. Athletics check with disadvantage, please. Oh my god. But Oh, all right. That sounds fair. D twenty two on deck. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Ha! Not too bad. Um, athletics probably isn't ten. Ten? Yeah. Mm -mm. Um, no, you don't. You, you you manage to hold on, but you don't manage to make any difference. The, the chains while flying around, you you don't have any movement. At Is that my point. whole action? That's your whole. That's your whole. That's your attempt at movement. It's not your action. Um, you can still let go if you want to. Nope. I'm gonna, you are 80 feet in the air, just for reference. I'm going to add Fuck. more weight to what I'm doing. I'm going to pull downwards and try and see if I can restrict the air to the griffin. Yeah, yeah. To see if oh, I what can. You're trying to like... I wanted to go unconscious. Yeah, great. No, I love that. Yeah, go go hard. Um, just make a so general hell. strength check, please. Because you're trying to pull your weight and like... There was a big moment of contention with making this character as well put the lowest stat in strength. I'm so glad I didn't do that. Uh, just a check or a saving throw? Uh, strength, strength check, please. Uh, 12. 12. Alright, I'm gonna make a con save here. I uh, rolled a 3. Uh, can you roll a d6 for damage, please? Straight d6. 5. 5. So the chain pulls a little bit and it just... Bounces. Pulls a little bit. Yep. Yeah, cool. Great. Uh, yep. Yeah, it's, it's, it's looking okay. It's looking okay. Uh, d22. Go to sleep! <laughs> uh, anything else? No. Cool. d22. Uh, running on pure instinct here, I, don't, I wouldn't say I'm necessarily going for a kill shot, but I want I want to try and help control what's going on. So I want to fire my my, my repelled up uh, crossbow up in the direction. Sure, of, sure. Of the Griffin. So That's yeah. Can help. Yep. Yeah. Go for it. Cool. Seventeen. Seventeen. Okay. So you aim. What? How much rope have you got? I um, think it's thirty feet. 
Um, hang on a second. 50, yeah. isn't it? Is it? You should have 50 feet of rope. Yeah, and that's 80 yeah. feet. 80. So, <laughs> rope, rope, so yeah, rope is 50 feet. Everything works. Your aim is true, and it flies up. And it falls 30 feet short, and the grappling hook just falls to the ground. <laughs> Sorry, bud. That would have hit otherwise. It was great. It was a great move. Um, cool. Is there anything <laughs> else you'd like to do? very special, though. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> can, I, can I start to... Spider-Man, right? It's like... I'm going to start to gather up that rope again. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'll let you. Yeah. As soon as it's done, you're just like fishing around. Like, <laughs> I'm just going. Cranking it back in. <laughs> yeah, like that's like, you can retract it in that time. You can you can do that as a bonus action. It's not a problem. Cool. Uh, great. Then do you want to move or do anything else? Um, no, I'm going to stay where I am. Great. Yeah. Cool. Saskia. Right, right. So this egg, how big is this egg? Uh, it's about the size of a rugby ball. Oh, great. Uh, can I pick it up and run? Yes, you can. Great. I'd like to pick it up and I'd like to run uh, north towards where the griffins usually. You, you're just going straight, straight north and stuff. I'm that just way. gonna get that egg away from here. Great. And I'm just love it. Oh, I love run everything about as this. As fast as I can cool. to do that. Yep. Uh, no, that's fine. So I'm gonna let you dash uh, so you can do 60 feet and around and you can just fucking. I'm just grabbing blitz that. Blitz it. Actually, it's free action, so you can go 90. So I'll let you dash and then dash again. So you've Thank got you. you've got that with your rogues. Cool. So you pick it up, you tuck it underneath, and you just you just dip. And you're, I'm gone. Yep, yeah, you're gone. You guys watch as she just takes off. Would you say Mayway can see this, or she's pretty occupied with what's happening? Oh, right you're now. not being subtle. Are you being subtle about this, or are you just? No, I'm grabbing and going. Like people see me, people see me. Uh, passive perception. Um, twelve. Okay. You don't. You do. Right. Yeah, yeah, you just, yeah, you're I'm still holding on, man. Yeah, do um, I? Because I'm right next to, like, you, you see it, yeah, yeah, so you'll see it except for you. Um, the griffin also sees it. So we'll see what happens on its next turn. <laughs> Great. I'm going to get close Alexi. to the ground. Um, I mean, I can't oh, really... Oh, it, sorry. Oh, yeah, no, that's everything, yeah. I can't really use my rapier to attack. You know, well, I? you could pull it out. Yeah, that's not... I've got plenty of D6s here if you want to find out what happens. No, I really don't. <laughs> um, <laughs> you also in the air? I'm, yeah. My sword is in it. Yeah, I thought you left it there. I didn't realise you came too. You no. Know? Cool. It's always us going First on thing adventures though, together. Strength check to see if you're still holding on. Right. <laughs> 17. Fine. All right. Um, shit. Okay, he knows that this is going to end badly real quick. Can I... I respect that this is going to be tricky. Uh, would it be possible for Alexi to kind of, like, get a rope from his pack and sort of, like, try and... Tie it around the griffin. It's going to take all your action, movement, bonus action to try and do that. That's fine. Yep, you can make an attempt, um, but yep. you're going to need to roll. <sighs> Hi. Hi. I'm just trying to think what to make you do on that. Um, because you're holding on for life. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to say it's 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 a feat. It's an athletics check because it's strength. I'll be able to hold on with one arm yeah. while searching through the pack. Um, and then I'm going to ask for a sleight of hand to see how well you try and tie up. So it's a two. It's a nice. two-parter on this. Yep. Okay, right. Uh, athletics first. Yep. 13. Cool. Next roll. Slight of hand. 16. Okay, so you, yeah, you manage to hold on and you fumble around. It takes it takes a minute, your packs are light and you sort of manage and you like cling it in and it's like, guns are going on, right? It's looking okay. You've been as best as you can do. Yeah. You reach in and you pull out the rope and you sort of like slap it and you try to like whip it around so yeah. it comes up and you catch it. So you haven't tied anything. Um, but you've got it all holding on, and now like another hand holding two bits of rope yeah. in between, and sort yeah. of like this two-parter at this yeah. point. Cool. And you're sort of like stuck there at this point, holding this rope, which cool. is dangling a little bit underneath. There's about 30 feet of rope underneath, hanging hanging down from there. What, what are you doing those two at the same time? Uh, Flying in the air. <laughs> okay, so I can still do stuff then? Nope, that's it. Oh, okay, great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just telling you, like, you haven't tied a knot, you've yeah. got the rope around yeah. it, you're holding, the rope, fine. you're that's holding the sword. That's fine. Uh, hopefully that'll start paying off next time. Or make staying on a bit easier. I'm just doing some math in my head for you. <laughs> my life. It's a good move. Respect it. <laughs> I'm so tempted to turn into a horse and come catch up with you. <gasps> Ooh! But I oh, think. Because you ride mine up. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. Uh... Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Hey, hey, she's... Say that... Come on. Come on. She's a flirtatious creature. We were riding in the previous game, so... stop. Hey, 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 that's the secret at home. Gotta earn that, all right? 
Um, but I wouldn't be able to, I'd be able to catch up to you at 60 feet, but then you wouldn't be able to move on your turn. I think, because I, because she could like get on me. Yeah, yeah. So if you if you jump on Myla, she's got full control of your movement unless you jump off. Yeah. So yeah, she's okay. got. Yeah. You're giving up that agency basically by riding her. But I can keep it, keep dash it. and take you 120 feet a turn. Right. Cool. Bright blue horse. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Uh, that's I need bright some, blue. I need yeah, that's not going to be easy to track. We're going to be seen. <laughs> Cool. You already seen. You can see. have a white horse. <laughs> so or immediately a blue after, <laughs> um, D twenty two. Since you seem to be the only one left here, you watch as Milo just runs and suddenly like jumps into the air mm-hmm. and turns to a blue horse, takes off. Sorry, uh, takes off running. Uh, I'm gonna stop, stop touching by that. Yeah, by the mic. Oh, this mic! I hate it so much. Um, and you just gallop on after. And how much movement have you got in that? Was it an action or a bonus action? Uh, or, so watch it. Wild shape is an action. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, so yeah, I can only go sixty feet, so I can just catch up to. Yeah. Uh, Sasuke. Yeah, cool. Well, she, she went 90, so you're still a little bit behind. Oh, you went 90? Yeah, so oh, it's a free action to pick up. It was movement yeah. plus dash plus double dash for the yeah, bonus action. Yeah, very nice, yeah. very nice. Um, yeah, so cool. you're, off, you're off the map that you're, you're chasing after. Cool. Yeah. Uh, right, it's the Griffin's turn. See a nerd. <laughs> so, thrashing about, it sees its one egg disappearing mm-hmm. into the forest and nothing else matters. It beats its turn. And just turns and goes, and it's going to use its full movement to catch up 80 feet straight across, coming down on top of you. You're slightly ahead at this point, um, but it's bearing down on you, and you're maybe about 20 feet ahead at this point. But if you were to look up, you'd see about 30 feet in the air, Griffin beating its wings, chasing you down, like chasing you down, ready to, ready to go for it. Uh, any strength saving throws in both of you, please? I just made it quite a big movement. Drunken. Natural 20. Oh my god! <laughs> what is going on? Holding on, yeah, you're doing you're doing alright. And the rope's now clipping the trees at the bottom. Yeah. Yep. I like this feeling really good. I'm very really sorry, yeah. 15. 15. Okay, you both hold on just just fine. Uh cool. That's the whole thing. Mayway, your turn. You're like holding on behind now. Alright. Um, as it flies. It's not trying to shake you off, so it's a little bit easier to hang on to. Cool. Um I'm gonna attempt to climb again. Great, go for it, athletics check. My lovely map, and you'll flew away from it. We made this, we got it. Yeah, nah, nah. Nah, we're gonna we're run going up again. <laughs> That's a five. That's a five. five. Yeah, it doesn't achieve anything. No, nope, You'll I only don't. fall off on like a really bad roll, so you, you hold on. Your arm's gonna be sore tomorrow, I'll say yeah, that. Yeah, I'm gonna regret this, and I'll just try and suffocate. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Again? That's fine. Go yeah. for it. Yep. Yeah. Uh, make a strength check, please. Yeah, better. What was it? 18. 18, yeah, cool. I'm gonna make a con save. Uh, it's a 13 plus one, 14. Yep, cool. Uh, D6 damage, please. Three. Three, uh, cool, great. It's, it's beating a little bit, like it's going for it, but it's getting tired. Like it's carrying two people and going full power trying to chase back its egg. Like it's very gone, like angry mama yeah. sort of mode. Yeah. Cool. Uh, anything else you'd like to do? Uh, no, that's my cool. D22. Um, he actually feels a wave of some kind of feeling, which feels like concern. Um, but he realizes, <laughs> he realizes that he's now kind of on his own uh, in the middle of nowhere. And I think you might have mentioned there was a dead half orc. Um, <laughs> oh, I did. Oh, I did. So that was very intentional. His, uh, his, eye, his eye kind of moves about and he calculates how far everybody is, and it's too far in order to run or catch up or be of any use. So he may as well go and. So pocket, yeah, if you'd like to, if you'd like to, uh, right. if you'd like to make an investigation check to search the area, I will allow that. Sixteen. Oh, so yeah, investigation would be twenty. So with a 20. dirty twenty, yeah. So I, I love, I love that all the actions taken off. We just cut back to silence and D twenty is like just winding up as. I'll we'll have a look around. Yeah. So with your dirty twenty, uh, so you investigate the area and so you check the body and after a second you find some coins have been spilled, um, as well as some. Quite gross provisions, but you find 22 gold coins and 59 silver coins in a pouch. Um, most of what's been taken on the on the half walk is is now rotted away, but the armor is a little bit rusted, a little bit damaged. But you could probably pick up. You've got a rusted plate armor as well, if you'd like to find that. And also, out of just like the flap of the um, of the nest, you see this quite nice um, kind of green, but kind of yellow cloak that seems to be blending in just a little bit. 
um, with area. Um, so you also have to find uh, Sasha, if you could please pass that to go. Okay. Thank you. You also find what appears to be Nata's cloak. Beautiful. Cool. Lovely. And anything else you'd like to do? No, I'm reveling. <laughs> Saskia, you're right. right. So Saskia is legging it. Can hear the old Griffin. <laughs> oh, is, that's close. Is unaware. Uh, can, can I hear? No, I'm unaware. Uh, you you would hear a galloping horse me? coming up behind you, I especially if you're making noise. Horse. So what? One more time. No, I'm not doing that again. <laughs> <laughs> um. And how far would could I run now? Another ninety feet. You can do ninety in a full, full, full turn. Yep. So you you're gonna catch up with me. I will. You will. Keep that. Keep dashing. Keep dashing. All right. So you keep dashing. But you look back and you see a bright blue horse, and you're smart enough to figure out I'm that like, it must be Milo. That you can't go on then. Cool. So you're running through, chasing it down. Great. There's all your movement, all your action, everything. No problem. Cool. Alexi. Uh, okay. So first things first. Tie that rope. Tie that rope. Yeah. Cool. Great. Okay. Uh, make a strength check for me, please. Oh, none of those. Fifteen. Fifteen. Yeah, cool. You were bearing down. You managed to tie it, pull down, get it taut. You bring yourself up onto the back of the griffin. Yeah. You tie a nice bow on top, and you you've got that rope tied onto it now. Okay. Sitting on the back. Great. You're now um, riding the griffin. It doesn't care because it's focused on something else, but you're now riding the griffin. All right. Um, that was your action. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So that's that's got me secure, right? You are secure now. Yeah. No more strength saves. Okay. So uh, yeah, Alexi's just gonna with his free hand basically just like grab onto a tuft of hair. Cool. And just pull the rapier from it and be ready to stab it. Great. Right. Cool. Time. You pull out it, but carries on. Yeah. Going on through. Cool. Anything else you'd like to do? Um, I think I've already used my action. No. Cool. I'm Love. just gonna yeah. Great. Right, the fucking griffin. Cool. Myla. 120 feet, let's go. <laughs> now, just because I want a really cool visual, how do you jump on Myla's back? She comes past you. Oh, sick. It's um, <laughs> the right answer. Okay, so, oh, yeah. Um, so, as I see in slow mo in my head, right? So, um, so Myla's like galloping along. I can see ahead of me that there's this um, rocks that kind of almost step up. So, I'm going to, in slow mo with this griffin egg under my arm, I'm going to. One, two, three, look back and just do the biggest jump, like leap of faith of my life. Just bam! Straight down, grab the reins, fucking come on! <laughs> no rain, <Yeah>, no rain. <laughs> no rain, no rain. There's no, no rain, just me. I'm gonna pretend there's rain. <laughs> just, uh, just get the hair. Just grab that hair. And just the awkward wrap around like, the neck of a Yeah, <laughs> yeah no. like I've gotta keep hold of this. Egg yeah, no well. roll for that. Uh, well, okay, just make make a. Make a deck save just in case you drop the egg. No. It's a really, really dizzy. I've got it. I can't. I can't make it a through there. No pressure or anything. Okay. This one, no. This one. No. <laughs> no. 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 You keep trying that one. It's this, not doing well. This one did really badly for me, so it might be nice to you. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Stop that. Dice right, logic. Yeah, yeah, the logic. Uh -oh. oh, it's nice to Ten. Well. Fine. Yeah. If you got anything lower than a five, you would have dropped it. Okay. Cool. Okay. But yeah, you, you, you gracefully you land and yeah, and off off you go. You're just chilling, Very man. Very cool. <laughs> Griffin chasing, bearing down, yeah. now brushing the bottom yeah. of the treetops, like making noise back. for everyone's ears, but yeah, still still coming through, cool. chasing you through dun, the forest. Dun, 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 cool. Dun, dun, dun. Um, yeah, you guys have now got him about 200 feet away from where you originally started moving. Um, right, Mayway. Um, uh, oh, strength saving through, please. God damn it. That was a terrible roll, but um, <laughs> 11. Nope. Your arm gives out. Mm. Cool. So you're 30 feet in the air. Ooh. Your arm comes out, you fall through the trees. Um, make a deck safe, please, to see if you can harm this damage. She's too low down for me to grab, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah no way. Yeah. yeah. yeah it's all right. 18. 18. So, yeah. Um, you take nine, by the way, so you take four points of bludgeoning damage. You fall through and you <laughs> piss on the trees. Land prone. Sorry, land prone <laughs> on the ground. <laughs> um, stopped. Still. Your weapon still tied around the griffin's neck. And I have no hope of my weapon anymore. You do not currently hold your nope. weapon now. All right. Cool. Uh, still your turn. You can still use your movement or action or whatever you want. I'm going to pull, pull out my longbow and try and clip a wing. Yep. Yep. I'll allow that. Specifically, try not to hurt I, I, anything main. I understand. Loud and clear. Yep. Cool. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> 
Everything's if fine. If you roll really badly. Oh no, David's safe. You're fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's literally a griffin between me. <laughs> Uh, 17 plus 6. 17, yeah. So with a, with a dirty 23, uh, yeah, you point out, you see through the tree line, it's starting to thin out as you're getting a little bit more north. You pull back. Uh, roll damage, please. That's a good point. 1d8. Uh, 3 plus 4, 7. Cool, great. It's looking pretty hurt. It, it, it stumbles a little bit in here and still still keeps flying. Nah, we're all good, we're all good, we're all good. <laughs> flying it after them, uh, flying it after. All right, D22. Could I ask how, how far away, for context, this is all going on now for me? How many? 200 feet. 200 feet. 200 feet. Okay. So can yeah, I have used my movement to yeah. keep following? Or? Oh yeah, 100%, yeah, yeah, you cool. can, yeah, you can do that, not a problem. Um, in my last throw, I was able to. W- did you include the nest in what I was searching for? That was including for? the nest as well. You, you, with the dirty, you found everything with the dirty twenty. Like in my immediate area, in that map in total. Can I c- explore further? Is there? You can look. You can look further, further, but it's quite. It's quite dead around the area. But you're more than welcome to keep having a look. Yeah. In which case, I may as well. Um, I will exercise my my my. my um, the longest dash that I possibly can, and try to try to get near to the other Yeah, so you can you can go a full anything. sixty feet with that. Then in that case, and start running the same direction they went. Yes, please. Cool, yeah. great. All right, uh, Saskia. Just get your ride in bareback. Yeah, great. You you can you can try and make a shot against it as well if you'd like. If you want to try and shoot back at the Griffin as it's coming after throw you, throw a dagger at it. Or, something. or you've got your bow. Yeah. Or you can just keep going. No, I'm just gonna keep going. All right. Yeah, I, cool. yeah. I'm just gonna just. Head down, like just streamline Sweet. it. Sweet, great, love yeah. it. Cool, Alexi. I'm very much tied on to this thing. You are I? very secure at this point. Right. Yes. Um, can I reach the chain? Uh, yep, you can create. You can reach up and try and untangle it. Sure, it's going to take an action. <laughs> yeah, but but if you drop it, then you might lose a weapon, which would go very well, I'm sure. Your eyes probably best to try and bring you down. Okay, Alexi will stab his rapier into the Griffin's wing. Body. Oh. Yep. Go for it. Um, is there a way of non-lethally doing that? Mm, make with, a roll with advantage. Just please. cripple, not kill. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ideally, just want to bring it down so everyone else. Make is an up. attack roll with advantage. Uh-huh. You're, there's no way I can stop you. I don't want three. to hurt the Griffin. I just want to just not kill. Um, that would be a nineteen. Yeah. Nineteen hits. Roll damage with your bonus bits. Yep. <laughs> It's pretty low, actually. Um, six piercing, three lightning. So it takes nine. All right. It's yep. looking very hurt. And it's starting to, like, can't quite keep up. Its movement slows and it's falling through. It's not falling, but it's, like, now in the thick of the tree. It's trying to keep up. One right. wing's got an arrow through it. The other one's a bit numb and, like, a bit of blood. Like, yeah, you know, It's okay. not healthy. Right. Um, that's going to be the rest at the end of my turn, but, like, just for kind of visual like mm-hmm. he's now going to be trying to sort of like struggle his way over and is going to try and grab the chain before getting the fuck off this yeah thing. sure 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 yeah sure. all right cool Myla. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> it's nothing else i can do and you're welcome to steer if you'd like just head on <laughs> straight down here we go i'm really good at running that's my thing in this just it's great yeah good all right you're- <laughs> Uh, the Griffin's going to make a con save to try and maintain its 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 flight. Uh, it failed. So the Griffin, its uh, its wings not quite given up, but it, its wings sort of like one stops and it goes in shoulder first, impacts the ground. Um, it impacts hard. It's not dead. Uh, need you to make a deck save, please. Ugh, 14. 14. 14 just succeeds. You manage to tuck and roll out of the way okay. as it lands and it just collapses. <sighs> Heaving. Mm-hmm. Cool. Now, for the sake of brevity, um, it's not dead, but the griffin is lying on the ground, bleeding out. It's just you. Um, and as the others start to catch up, as you recover the weapon, you guys aren't to know, but we're going to end the episode there. <laughs> Uh, with Lexi standing over a griffin by himself, see what happens next. Cool, and I think yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point to end. So hey, thank you so much. What a lovely light note to end the episode <laughs> on. Um, 
Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, that was that was a good time. Oh my god, that took a turn. That took mm. a hell of a turn. We'll save it. We'll save it the post post show chat. Um, great. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll see you next time. Um, until then, yeah, I still don't know how to sign us off. We just do a big high pitch bye. 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 Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>